that mic was off. Relaxing days like this are nice. Yeah, That's they are. Easy. So cute. <sighs> it has been a while. Ah, all right. I wonder if people are like human right now, but it's like it is currently three twenty-four p.m. my time. I don't think people are human right now. Hi Alpi, hi Kaiko, welcome to the stream. Morning, good evening, good afternoon. Whoa, my headset died. Oh shit, that's bad. Wait, did I not charge my headset? Oh, it didn't charge itself. All right, hold on, give me a while. Woo, that's unfortunate. Everyone look at like Nilu for a bit. <laughs> All right, sure. Let's do this instead. How is everyone? Good afternoon. Ow! Shut. Morning. Good evening. First, get into position like this, then move like that. Yep. Jake, stare. Hello, everyone. Good afternoon. Morning. Good evening. Welcome to three point six. It has been a while since I've actually. Well, it's been a while since I've streamed. Like here, I've been. Um, what do you call that? I've been. Uh, doing a lot of schoolwork and doing a lot of, um, <laughs> doing a lot of projects and doing a lot of videos, honestly. Good afternoon, good afternoon. Half human, but a human nevertheless. Hi, Aru, welcome. Aru is it like, don't you have classes? I'm gonna call out Aru. I don't know if uh, Aru has classes right now. The Hydra Archon, yes. I was like messing around with a Nilu Kale official cookie combo, but let's just say I ran out of resin trying to farm for them. Um, this was the team that I was running for in the Abyss, so uh, I have to pay respect to like. Well, I got my go I got my money, <laughs> so let's actually just swap out of this. But hello, everyone! Welcome, greetings, and salutations to all of you. We're just gonna be doing um, the three point six event today. Just a bit of a, if you must know, just got from home from school. Damn, right, it was like 3 p.m. for all of, for, for us right now. Alright. Hello, greetings, welcome. Man, I need to attend classes too, but been busy doing HSR. Is it really being busy? <laughs> Is it really being busy? No, no, no. I was gonna play HSR, but life just kind of grabbed me by the ball sack. Therefore, here we are. Here we are, happy to be here. So, we're going to do an entire run through today of the. What do you call that? We're gonna do an entire run through of the new of the new event because I just finished it, and I hope that you guys. Oh, I just finished it. I just it just finished releasing. I mean, so I hope that you guys already enjoy. Hope that you are all having a great and wonderful time. If the stream is paused, it's because I'm currently all tabbed. No worries about that. Hey, yeah, so did you know that they added a room in Boo Boo Pharmacy? Really. To commemorate, um, Baiju. Baiju's gonna come out in a few hours. Wait, let's see, how long do I have before Baiju? I really want Kave, because I'm- s I really want to make a video about Kave. I swear. Alright, Genshin has an event. I like how- I like how Genshin has an event and everyone's just like, Oh, right, Genshin has an event. Because they were busy playing, uh, what's that? Uh, HSR? It's- <laughs> it's, it's great, it's great. Oh, by the way, did you know that they changed like the picture for the height for the pyro red just fine? Yeah, um, it was like it's really old, but like I'm, I'm every time that I start stream, I just like say that because I know some people that haven't seen it before. Anyway, so what are we doing today? Everyone's like kind of dead right now. It's actually not a good. Idea. It's like three p.m. My time is like dead hours for a lot of um for a lot of places, but I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. Because I, I have afternoon and I am kind of sleepy, so we're going to stream Instead of going to sleep 3 30 p.m. is siesta time. Yes, it is actually my bedtime 3 30 p.m. to 6 p.m. is my bedtime 
Um, so I'm actually very, very groggy. Finish your R and R quest? No, I have a life. <laughs> no, I have work to do. I can't. I don't want to finish the R and R quest. It's not voiced. My attention span. I about it. Like the funny thing is, like I, I read the I, I I've read like most of the stories already on Wiki on the on the Wiki page, so that's great. Okay, I thought it was crazy. Pyro just my icon actually changed. Yeah, they did. Wait, let me see. I'd rather touch grass than touch the Aranara quest, dude. Oh man, the Aranara quest is like, ooh, spicy. You cannot be serious. Oh, sweet lord in heaven. Ooh. Whoopsie daisy. I forgot that Genshin has a bad rep of doing this. As in, people can't multitask. Oh, shit. Well, we're gonna be here for a few hours, guys. <laughs> Wait. Wait, I didn't even accept these people. I can cancel these. Wait, no, I can't. Munch. My gosh. No! You're su you're supposed to be better than this! You're from a nation of wisdom! Why can't you multitask, you degenerates? Aw, oh, man, I'm sad. Okay, let's go. Time to speed run all of these. <laughs> okay, so where do we go first? We have to go through fragmented testimony. Eh? Involved in the quest, right? The quest occasion kids involved in the- Wait, what? Who? Who? <laughs> Where? This is what happens when you try to do your homework instead of playing Genshin Impact. You can quick start the quest. It's not letting me. I already did. That's what I pressed. You can't- you can't do it. Apparently the quest location is currently involved in some- Fragmented testimony. Who? The quest and cancellation slander. Oh man, what? Wait, who? Wait, I'm confused. <laughs> Where is it? There's so many. <laughs> okay, now I actually have to find where it is. Oh, Al Haytham's is fragmented testimony. Okay, next. Oh, okay, so I guess we're going to hang out with Hal Haytham today. It's giving us a part and don't believe you to move your back and do your quest and let your homework go. No, 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 no. Do your schoolwork first. Do your college life first. Genshin can come afterwards. Genshin will stay forever, but your deadlines are coming in the next three hours. Don't do it. Wait, you do need to, to do the... to unlock stuff in story quests. I'm gonna beat something up. Good news is you don't need to finish Nilu's quest, just 80% of it? Oh, all right. You know what? We're just going to rename this stream real quick to uh, finishing the <laughs> finishing stuff, then doing the world quest. You know what's gonna be funny is I'm going to end this um to end this session. It's gonna be very very long. I don't think I have four hours of energy in my life, but I guess here we are, guys. This is we are doomed. What the? Someone messaged me on Instagram. I still don't understand why Instagram has a DMing platform. Okay. Um. I was... I was wondering if you guys are... Can you hear the background noise? I was... I'm, I'm curious if you can hear the background noise because... Um, I actually don't have... Um... I don't have my headset on right now so hopefully that's not the case but you guys um you have the energy back once the banners come up it's been a while since i've actually played genshin if my, if my quests are not indicative of any of that so let's go hang out with alhatham let's go hang out with nansplain <laughs> just a teeniest bit truly my questions are playing but i haven't tried it it's a pretty good game i've played like the first few hours of it i haven't progressed much because huh when life gives you lemons and stress but such is the case. I can hear the music. That's fine. I guess. But if you guys are hearing double sound, it's because I don't have my headset uh, charged right now. Hopefully the dialogue doesn't pick up against itself. But if that's the case, we're just going to have... What did you name your Wander? My Wander's name is Wander. But I had I already used the item to change it. it his name used to be Kuzoka, Kusogaki. Right. And while we're doing this, I'm gonna be... Chillin'. 
Okay, let's see. I hope that you guys enjoyed, um... Island for Stress sounds like a recipe for freshly squeezed lemonade. Did I I kind of want some lemonade right now. I'm gonna go, like, while this quest is playing, I'm gonna go order something. I named my Wander Scare, but why does YouTube have this as an emo? What the hell is that? That's a great question. What is that? Uh, hey there. Excuse us, but is Sino at the Academia? Wait, how come I can't use my, my super stickers? Wait, what? How come I can't use that? Oh wait, I can. Wait, why can't I use my super stickers? It's not fair. You two look familiar. Are you friends of Mahamatra Sino? Um, I'm afraid he's out on a mission right now. But if you'd like, I can pass whatever message you might have onto him. No. We ran into this guy by the gates, and he seems really eager to speak to Mahamatra. <laughs> it sounds like something urgent. Dude, he sound he looks like he's dissociating. Oh. Is he good? If you don't mind, why don't you tell me about it first? <laughs> I bet my I have a big boo boo. <laughs> he looks like when the kid goes Suraj. into his parents' room and just wait. What the? Suraj. That name sounds familiar. Isn't he a Vahumana researcher? Vahumana. Yes. Oh, oopsie. One of most renowned, in fact. I hear he's as daring as he is intelligent. So neither. There are rumors he'll become Vahumana's next sage. Uh, but <laughs> see the what NPC that Wander stole from the title. Oh, no, it's a cap, but um. I want to report him for, for conducting, conducting an ex experiment. Wow! He kidnapped me, tied me up, and took me to that horrible cave. Hi, Ariel. Experimental equipment everywhere. Ooh, glad to see that Sumer Academia is still upholding the previous Grand Sages uh, motif of human experimentation. I Very nice. I could, a little slower and he would have caught me. <laughs> he's talking like him like he's a... <laughs> okay, okay, There's gotcha. No Please, take your time. He's literally talking about getting grabbed and experimented on. What do you mean there's no rush? What kind of experiments were he conducted? Where is this cave? I don't remember. Huh? You can't remember? L plus Bozo. All I remember is Siraj walking towards me, and then my <laughs> head started feeling weird. You sure it wasn't because he's hot or something? It's like a nightmare that I can't recall. I what am I kidding? This is a is Genshin Impact on PC. must be stopped. Oh, I heard they conduct business in the tavern. We have to hurry. Baiju find my wife's throat? Dude, Baiju arrives for me in like two hours. Even if what you say is... Alright. <sighs> I'll have some of my colleagues look into Siraj. <laughs> what are you gonna find? If this guy is as smart as you say he is, you're not gonna find anything. And he is tomorrow, I think? Oh, I have to pay respect. I forgot that Asia gets the benefit of being, you know, living in the future. But before that, and something stupid like, like that. Hi, Varun, welcome to the stream. Test. You think I'm lying? Yes. Please don't take it the wrong way. This is just standard protocol. He's calling you a liar. Sorry, but can you two wait out here a little while? We'll be back. Sure, no problem. He's gonna kill him. He's just gonna kill him. I'm sorry. You wait somewhat longer than expected. <gasps> it's Biceps Man. Huh? Look at him. I hate him. He was the guy Let that robbed you. Ito of his muscles! First things first, Ilyas passed the lie detector test. Lie detector test?! <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Every time that I hear the word lie detector, the first thing that I hear is like, you know those YouTubers that are just like, like the guy that just makes everyone do the lie detector test and it's just like the heart, the heart beats? <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, all right, sure, sure, sure. This indicates that what he said is highly credible. Truly, so truly, the shock. It's not shock. It's more like, oh, I don't remember. It was like, it was like the guy. It was that old dude that hooks people up into a machine, and it like if the lines are fucky wucky. I I don't know if it was shock. I don't think they were electrically shocked. I don't think I'm, I I don't know if they were <laughs> electrically <laughs> shocked. Was reported to acting Grand Sage Al Haytham. After hearing about it, he left a message for Mahamatra Sino and we have to join the investigation. <laughs> Per protocol, this matter was reported to Acting Grand Sage, Al Haytham. After hearing that, he left a message for Mahamatra Sino and then asked to join the investigation. 
Dude has nothing better to do. Huh. It's kind of weird for you to be working with the Matra. Is there a special reason? Unfortunately, he is now the acting Grand Sage, so he has no choice but to be working with the Matra whether he likes it or not. The guy who was behind the computer in every YouTube video. You're overthinking things. My interest was piqued is all. He's just like me, guys. He hears, like, human experimentation. The next thing he has, like, a 10-minute essay on YouTube. Really? I'm unsurprised you have this much free time. Sign up for a card for one million more. Yikes. In that case, let's join in as well, shall we, traveler? Abdo, if what you said is right, and I don't know what the context of that is, if that's the case, then Sino bought, like, two packs worth of divine knowledge. J like, that one Arcan quest in Sumeru, it takes 500,000 more to buy one capsule of divine, of like illegal knowledge or something, right? <laughs> Already against protocol for acting Grand Sage Al Haytham to participate in this investigation. As for you two. It's already against protocol. But why? Why would it be against protocol? He has the power to say no protocols. No, no, no. Oh, never mind. After all, you were the ones who brought Ilyas here. I'll allow you to accompany us, but you have to promise to keep everything confidential. You have no idea who I am. Don't you think it's kind of irresponsible to be sharing with me the academia secrets? Hey, you're back here! Yeah, I decided that lore is, uh, lore streams are going to be here, while gameplay streams and just other miscellany are going on Twitch. It's, a, it's easier that way. Keeps this channel kind of less cluttered. Don't you worry, our lips are sealed! No, they're not. Alright, in that case... I'll fill you in on what we know so far. <laughs> Ilyas claimed that Siraj will be conducting some business with a Kasharawa researcher at the tavern. This is one of his few clear memories. It seems he stumbled upon this information while escaping. Sino collects cards of course is loaded? Oh, true. Incidentally, Siraj isn't at the academia right now. He applied for long-term off-site research one month ago. It's close to the time that Ilyas had given. So we've decided to head to the tavern and investigate any suspicious persons. That's okay. right. Okay. Arav, prepare to head out. You two, do as you will. Goodbye. Come on, we already said that we're coming. Come on, give us the lore, Hatham. They've got nothing better to do. It's not like they can just like look for their sibling. Oh wait, what do you call a fisherman archon? Barbados. <laughs> I shouldn't have laughed at that. <laughs> I thought of something even worse. What do you call a fish, Archon? Beals of. <laughs> I can't even finish that train of thought. Oh, I'm so dumb. I'm so dumb. I'm sorry. This is what happens when I don't get my sleep at 3 p.m. Is this all Hatham's quest? Unfortunately, Genshin and Fat characters cannot multitask, so we're, go we're we have no choice but to do this. Also, what's a good what's what's a good to order from Grab right now? I'm kind of hungry. I just want to order like a venti Starbucks. That's kind. Of, someone gave me suggestions on what to buy. I kind of want food. I'm um, twenty four chicken. Yeah, I don't want to die. Magdo, maybe. What if Wander didn't wander, guys? <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> then he just be called Ur because his entire <laughs> his entire existence is a mistake. And if you get that, that's kinda sad. Sweet madame. Dokito burger. What's a Dokito burger? Wait. Can't you carry this but we can slavery? Our, 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 it's fine. <laughs> Ever heard of crazy wings? Good nachos and quesadillas. I don't think we have that in the Philippines, so we'll all see. And Dox burger. And Dox does not have a burger. Right? Andre can get your food free of charge. Quit following me. Do I really want food from a guy that's like flies everywhere? Like with that trajectory. There was a chest right here. Take it and have fun. Whoa. Huh, the more you know. The Kita burger is the one good chicken burger that FB discovered. Huh. Glad to see that Facebook does have a reason for its existence. Gives us the Dokita Brothers. Is that a thing here? Can I order that? Dokita Burger. I kind of want chicken. Or something crispy at least. Oh no! These are undocks. Never mind. 
God, I love... I love Wander's like... Oh! Shit! Alright, this is why I'm not a student of the academia. I'm kind of stupid. Whee! Wait, I'm curious. What time is it for everyone there? Like, I'm genuinely curious. What time is it for all of you people? We're here, Acting Grand Sage all hate them. What's our next course of action? Not die. Hmm. Hmm. Acting Grand Sage all hate them. Looks like you haven't read any memos lately. <laughs> the new academia decree clearly states that even a sage doesn't have the authority to interfere with the Matra's actions during an ongoing 3 43 a.m.? Whoa, we are 12 hours, like, sharp. 3.43 p.m. 2.40... Okay, so some people are, like, only 2 to 3 hours away from me. The others are... Really, really far. Wow. Hmm, time zones. If your superior were here, he wouldn't be asking me what to do. Instead, he'd be telling me to stay out of the way. You're making this very unnecessary for everyone involved. Alhatham's like the kind of person that either doesn't say anything or suddenly just has like someone on the phone and it's from customer service. I would like to speak with your manager. Jesus. What a Karen. <laughs> You're right. Understood. Then please wait here as we lock down the perimeter and search for suspicious persons. No, 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 you gotta put your foot down! I'll hate them just means Sino would tell them to tell him to piss off. As he should. As as Sino should. Sino should definitely tell El Hatham to piss off. Ilyas, please stay here. Acting Grand Sage El Hatham, I'll have to trouble you with the protection of our primary witness. Acting Grand Sage with the protection of our I'll have to try Why? I thought that I thought that El Hatham was saying that they should just tell him to fuck off. <sighs> sure. Though I'd rather he just protect himself. True. Dehydrate. <laughs> This is his story quest, right? Yeah. This is where we get the- Whoa, I swear, Ito got robbed. Ito got robbed so hard because this guy gets to have abs and he doesn't. Answering a simplistic question only enables the question- <laughs> His muscles are so fucking big. <laughs> Ito clearly. got robbed. Oh god, Ito got robbed. Ito got robbed so hard. Answering a simplistic question only enables the questioner. Besides, I need him to understand my position clearly. He's really milking this acting grand sage thing, Aura huh? has just as many doubts about my coming along as you do. But unlike you two, he's making this matter more complicated than it is, with his considerations like the acting grand sage is trying to seize the Matra's powers. <laughs> Alright, got it! <laughs> that question was obviously bait. The Matra were once under the influence of the sages, and so were and so often, we're often subject, subject to these bureaucratic, bureaucratic traps. traps. It's like <laughs> the test was strictly unnecessary though. I Stream on campus? I am not on campus. I, I don't have classes time. today. Easy. Wait. Wait. I don't get it. So Oh, okay. He's basically saying that it's like when your mom tells you that yes, you can go out with your friends. But they'll never come back. Kind of like that. Kind of like that. Thanks for your video, so quote those to Thank you. Ugh, why is this so complicated? Exactly! Why are they making this so unnecessary complicated for both of them? This is why I was against becoming the acting Grand Sage from the very first. Titles, Titles and, rank and ranks inevitably make, make a lot of more troublesome, troublesome than, than usual. usual. Excuse me, acting Grand Sage, I'll hate them. I've had a question on my mind, and I need to know the answer no matter what. Have we met before? I have a question. Um, is the audio okay for you guys? Or do you want me to like tone it down? Because this will be a VOD. So I need to make sure that the audio is like pretty good already. Or else... This will be a, a lot of trouble. I'm sorry, but I really hate Ilyas' voice. It's... It's... I... I guess. I... Um... Alright, audio seems good for everyone. Alright. No, I have no I have recollection, no recollection of, ever of ever meeting you. Meeting you. <laughs> it would have been so much better if you just said, No, I have no idea who you are. Haha, <laughs> I thought so too. <clears throat> I probably wouldn't have had anything to do with someone of your caliber. Oh my gosh, this is so pathetic. Then why did you ask? Yes, exactly. Well, 
For some reason, I felt a sense of familiarity when I met you for the first time. Daddy? <laughs> really? <laughs> when I look into his eyes, I see the familiarity of a mother's hug and an Asian's parents' cursed case. A misperception, perhaps. Or... Acting Grand Sage Al Haytham, we've apprehended a suspect. Oh? I thought Siraj was the suspect. And by suspect, I mean the guy being accused. Siraj? No, it's the Kashara. First time, guys, love your videos. Thank dealing. you. I hope that you enjoy this little stream because apparently I have to do all the world, all the character quests to do the, the, the new event. So, I'll be here for a few hours, guys. Wait, uh, can some Ew, your haircut! I Ew! That I, I did steal some mechanical components from the lab and sell them, but does something like that really warrant the personal interest of the acting Grand Sage? Oh, you didn't do human experiments? You're not good enough for this. What have I got myself into? I, I know I let Greg get the best of me, but, but, but please, I promise that this won't ever happen again. I'm sorry I had homework. Oh my god, it's the Levi haircut, but worse. Yeah, it's like a Levi haircut, but it's flat. Ah, it's so ugly. It's so good seeing you live because I have something to do with other adventure videos. I would like to ask him a few questions. Yeah, hours course. would it be enough, I think. I have a D&D game in like five hours, so I'm hoping that like... Do you know Siraj? <laughs> yeah, Siraj is sauce. That's the name of my buyer. Buyer. He, he asked, asked to make, to make the, transaction the transaction at the tavern, at the tavern but, but he, he never, never showed, showed up. up. What Ooh. were the details of this transaction? He's doing some kind of experiment that seems to require many Hello. power generators and electrical components that can only be found in our project. He oh. contacted me in private and said that he'd pay a large sum of Mora if I was willing to put some aside for him, under the pretense of them being defective parts. Defective he parts? He originally agreed oh, to meet okay. at the tavern earlier today to do the trade. I sure didn't expect to get stood up or run into you all. Hey, Astro, have you done the collection of dragons and snakes quests in Academia, the one that that meets Enjo? Yep, I have. Still, still a pretty long quest, honestly, but pretty, pretty good. Perhaps Siraj was aware that Ilyas might leak information, so he intentionally didn't show up. Whatever the case, <laughs> seems that this lead ends here. The good news is, regardless of what Siraj was planning, his progress will now be severely hindered by a lack of power generators and electrical components. We still have time to conduct our investigation. Do you have Ooh. any more questions for the suspect? No, he's all yours. But Goodbye. I'd like to. I'd like to borrow, borrow Ilias, Ilias for, a while. for a while. Okay. Why? Oh, that's fine. I'm a lore play. Same Abdo. I actually don't like whatever I can play alone. It's like I, I just click past it and I read the wiki. Because I really have a... <laughs> they are slow. We conducted a comprehensive lie detection exam, which showed that he has a comprehensive case lie. Of only Levi can pull the... Only Levi can pull the... Is it Levi However, or Levi? I'm curious. What do you need him for exactly? Of course, if we're going to have human sacrifices as one of the reasons we're persecuting Siraj, then obviously more humans means that we can just bait him out regularly. I don't understand why this is so unclear to you people. The more humans, the more that he'll be willing to negotiate us for the test subjects. This is why I'm a university student, guys, and not like these bozos here. <laughs> I've read some papers regarding amnesia, and I'd like to try restoring his memories. Esther, do you know some Spanish? No, I'm a Filipino, unfortunately. I see. We'll be returning to the academia then. I'll leave Ilyas in your care. Esther, did you read Al Haytham's story quest? Like the one I'm doing Follow right me. now? No. Dude, he is so pale. <laughs> this man looks like he shouldn't be seeing the sun. Dude, he's an ironically hot. I didn't think I'd understand the appeal of Al Haytham, and now that I'm really thinking about it, he's really hot. Tavern, and Narendra didn't give us any leads. Ugh, that means we're stuck. It's stuck. Al Haytham, are you serious about seeing <laughs> through? Paimon's pretty surprised that you're this interested in the case. This bozo's here literally read read books in a day more than you will do in your whole life. A perfect example why nerds should never get power. They should touch grass. And that's really hilarious to say because I have like I've been forced to read 50 pages of readings for the, like in one day yesterday 
And I'm just like, yeah, this bozo also reads more than me. I will not deny that. Lemal. Isn't those bozos also equivalent to college grads? No, they're worse. <laughs> they're the people that went through college but like went through all of it without actually understanding why they went through college in the first place. <laughs> Imagine being Al Haytham's roommate. Dude, his abs are so good. So that so that she can voice. I thought you would have guessed the reason by now. Was it the muscles, the indifference, or the smarts that got you? Honestly, it's the whole package. I love me a boy that has his life together. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, Hyman has no clue. Hey, do you know? He's hot, but his attitude is a turn off for me. True, he's the kind of people that I would admire from afar, but never try to talk to, and if they ever try to approach me, I'll start walking away. Like... If I were to ever meet him in real life, I'm just gonna go... No. Kinda like Wanderer. If I ever want- If I ever met Wanderer in real life, I'm just gonna be like... No, 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 no. I'll hate him's an aesthetic. He's a- he's a- he's an aesthetic because he's fictional. But if he's real, God help me. It ain't yes. worth it, boys. It ain't worth we it. We were classmates. Ooh. How come you got to wear the cool outfit and he didn't? <laughs> oh, so that's why you asked to come along when Ara briefed you on the situation. <laughs> All right. So you're not here because you're interested in the case itself, but because you know the suspect. Assuming life releases you, you from the chokehold, yeah. You from the truth, but I wasn't expecting much from you to begin with. That's true. Pop off when Paimon eventually becomes the ultimate god of te of, of Tevat. You're all fucked. <laughs> But pop off! <laughs> you know what someone told me? You know what someone told me? Everyone's like laughing at- Everyone's laughing at Paimon now. Like how they used to- uh, How the Bible says that people used to laugh at Jesus. But then when Jesus like resurrected, everyone was just like- oh! <laughs> That's exactly what's happening right now. When- When Wanjir like bullied her to shut up because it was a conversation between the gods. Yeah. They're gonna be so fucked when she becomes like- <laughs> The ultimate god. I'm sorry, I don't know where that train of thought came from. For the time being, all you need to know is that we were oh my once God, classmates. They were classmates. I became the scribe afterwards while he continued his academic endeavors. The traveler doesn't know. No, 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 the traveler's kind to her because he knows. Sage at the time, my opinion, <laughs> so Paimon is Jesus, I, I didn't say that. <laughs> because it committed one of the six cardinal sins by touching upon human evolution. I did not approve of it because it committed one of, by touching upon human evolution. Monkeys. Monkeys. We are the monkey. From violating matters regarding human evolution to attempting the forbidden and fearing none, the six cardinal sins are the origin of all evil in this world. They are also what the sages use as a reference when formulating or amending the rules of the academia. Hayas' own aesthetic department so disconnected to the themes they convey that it can easily keep some people away. Yeah, I noticed that. What do you call that? <laughs> no, nobody will forget the lawyer incident. My opinion Monkey. is that Siraj's research was both overly naive and in violation of various core principles. The Grand Sage took some of my suggestions on board and ultimately decided to reject the application. <laughs> Idiot. So that's why he's buying energy sources and electrical components. He's most likely trying to circumvent the rules and conduct his experiment in secret. You can't study the origin of words, that's a cardinal sin. I can't believe that Genshin Impact is calling all the linguists sinners of God. It was nice knowing all of you. We are about to kill an entire discipline. The entire habitat section. That sounds super <laughs> suspicious. Oh, we gotta stop him. Ilias, can you try to remember things again? Maybe something new will pop up. I'm sorry, but I've already tried many times. And no matter how hard I try, it feels like everything in my mind is shrouded in a thick mist. Did you have your mandatory mental health away when we... <laughs> I'm sorry, I couldn't say that with a straight face. Did you have your obligatory... Uh, did you have your mandatory wellness break? <laughs> it is possible for a person to subconsciously forget some of their memories as a defense mechanism This guy should just try harder, stress. SMH. True. However... These memories aren't truly lost, but, but merely, merely sealed, sealed away. away. 
They can, they can be restored, restored with the appropriate, with appropriate stimulus. stimulus. You're just going to have to, you know, recount the time that you were humanly experimented on. Hold on, if you give us where the cave is, we can definitely just lead you there and we'll, you know, we'll trigger some important memories for our research, of course. Now, try to recall things you care about. They don't need to be related to this case. Well, actually, Why is he playing I therapist? feel like I've forgotten more than just the memories of the time I was kidnapped and experimented on. Oh? The kind of person I am, the things I've done. I first you should hire for voice acting. I can't remember some things, but I can't recall some others, no matter how hard I try. But I have a good you. It's like three a.m. Good night. There are two things that I have to do, no matter what. What? Do tell. No. <laughs> the first is to get my paper from the academia and give it to my younger sister in Gondarva. <laughs> What's a way to beat amnesia? Money. <laughs> I'm not sure about the details, but it seems that I would send money ah, to my younger sister hello. every month oh. to pay for family Wait, expenses. Okay. Bye-bye. Oh, sorry, my dad went in. He told me that he was going to uh he was going to pick up my mom. He's gotta get that bag. Dude, <laughs> you could have amnesia. But damn, money doesn't buy you happiness, but it sure does cure you of your uh, experimented <laughs> mental capacity. And the second thing? Your seats are records, I guess. Yeah, he has to make sure, right? Like he was experimented on, you know, human, uh, humanely uh, <laughs> defiled, I guess. But he just has to pay the IRS. He has to make sure that he doesn't have any of those logs uh, tampered with. I can't remember. Sorry, there's just so much I can't recall. Yeah, but Not you gotta make sure those taxes are paid. <laughs> However, you're the only one who has seen Siraj and knows the exact location of his cave at present. As such, As such we'll, we'll do everything, do everything we, can we can to help you regain your, your, your memories. memories. Losing your memories must be, must be really, really painful. painful. But don't, but don't worry. worry. We'll help you get them all back. <laughs> oh, thank you so much. This feeling, it's more than just pain. I don't know how to describe it. Um, you ever try a picture book? Usually that helps. I have so few memories that I don't even have a clear idea of who I am. And my head's always ringing. It feels like I could faint at any moment. Is it weird that you can do a good Chan Sung voice? I've actually haven't heard what the snake, how, how the snake speaks, so I wouldn't know, honestly. Drink water? You're right. The, the water's all on the other side of the room. We'll get that later. But amidst all that, it also, it also feels, feels like, like I've been set, set free, free somehow. somehow. Apparently not by the IRS. Nevertheless, I have you all to thank for bringing me what clarity I do have right now. Okay. <laughs> now, I do remember that I worked part time at a place in the academia called the Research, the Research Preparation, Preparation Center. Center. And that's, that's also, also where, where I got I my got monthly my... paycheck. Okay. I see. In that case, let's go and find whoever's in charge there. I've never seen anything from this world quest, but what if, like, he just denied the guy? Um, what if? What if? I, I'm, I'm, I'm pulling the straws here. Actually, no. I'll, I'll keep my theory to myself. I don't want to know if it's right or wrong. I just choose to believe that the guy held him hostage as like because he wanted to paddle us for a thesis defense, but the guy was like, "No, you you commit the sins of the the six cardinal sins." <laughs> Quit following me. Tamara dudes have a lot of money from where. Tell Nahida. Dude, Nahida gets like a cool ass palace, while Venti doesn't even get a house. <laughs> Nahida gets like a, like the, the Siristana, the Shri- uh, <laughs> But, Venti doesn't even get like half a home. Man, that sounds like college, true. I actually have a paper that's due and I need to defend it. Like, I have three papers that are due and I need to defend them very, very soon. Are these scenes really that bad? Hey, let me pull them up. They're from Sino's uh, story quest, actually. Let me look for it. Sino has a wh the whole list um, delineated. Where is it? Story. Um. 
Where is it? Oh no. This is gonna look so ugly. There it is. <clears throat> sure, let's see you with the venti voice. To prevent researchers from being, from being devastated by their own knowledge, the sages laid out six cardinal sins. They held that all of the crimes in this world derive from these six sins. The first is to interfere with human evolution. The second is to tamper with life and death. The third is to delve beyond the universe. The fourth is to investigate the origin of words. The fifth is to revere gods without acts of devotion. So basically going to church, right? Um, Basically going to church and not praying to God. Oh wait, no. Praying to God but not going to church. This is where you die, folks. This is where you die. The sixth is to attempt the forbidden and fear none. Something, something. Since then, the sages have been introducing new rules and regulations according to these six deadly sins. While lamenting and revisiting all one, something, 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 something. <laughs> Pheasants. Just like the real world. Yeah. What I don't want to know is why the origin of words is the case. Oh. That's fair. Because, like, in our world, we have linguistics, right? We have, we have linguists that actually study um, the formation of language. But in their world, because Tevat only operates with like one spoken language, I think, and multiple written languages instead, it, like the role of a linguist isn't that big. But the thing is, like, why the origin of words? Is it just symbolic? Do they just murder every linguist they know? Hi, Ritty, welcome to the stream. Teresa with the palace and the most money. Dude, this is massive, by the way. I was so worried that we wouldn't be able to go in here before. We relate to the myth of the Tower of Babel. Yeah, that's probably the case. If you don't know what the myth of the Tower of Babel is, it's basically... Um, humanity used to have one spoken tongue, but they wanted to like create a tower. Um, I was actually going to make a video about that. Um, they wanted to create a tower that was that reached God itself. God got offended and made it and broke that tower and made it so that everyone spoke different words. You know. Just in case. <laughs> the common tongue and uncommon pen. True. They have different writing systems, which is very fascinating. You think that people with multiple writing systems would also have like multiple spoken oh. systems. Damn, look at this place. If it's like pretty tiny. Like if if you were in your university, this for me this is pretty tiny as a as a library, but damn, it's, it's so big. It's so unnecessarily big. <laughs> what this do? Go up. Oh. Where am I going? Where are you taking me? My brother in Christ, where am I going? One is Latin script everywhere plus regional scripts. Yeah. Tivat language is... Tivat spoken language is similar. That's why, uh, uh, you know, they can understand each other. Where am I? I have never been here before. Where is this place? Oh! Wait, what? This is the Archon Quest, right? I'm not insane. This is the Archon Quest. That was a very long <sighs> elevator ride. Too slow. I mean, doesn't every university have a secret tower leading to a dungeon? You know what was funny, right? Um, I had classes uh, for two uh, around a year already on campus, and then there was a new teacher. Uh, there was a new subject that I had, and I was asking, "Where's the where's the classroom?" And I shit you not, the only thing they told me was check the basement. I have been studying in that building for two for. A year and a half and I didn't even know we had a basement. So I was just like, what basement? Our building doesn't have a basement. It just has like two floors. And they were like, no, no, no. Check the basement. Apparently we did have a basement. <laughs> I was There's so no I was so confused and worried because it was really fucking dark. To force a but apparently we had a basement. <laughs> just to occupy silence. That's where they put the people that like plagiarize. It was really fucking creepy, but at the same time, I was like, "We, I, how did I not know that we had this? And why, why, why is there only one entrance to it? Where am I? Oh, this is the, this is the police. Okay, that's where Shoki Kami is hiding. Oh, 
It doesn't help that the university is around 100 years old, you know. Kind of scares me. <laughs> but we don't talk about that. Quit following me. Whee! Hello, Hello, old man. Uh, acting Grand Sage Alhatham. I've sent this period's research expenses report to your office. Have you taken a look? Are there any issues with it? I did. Recent, Recent research, research expenses, expenses, expenses have decreased, have decreased quite a bit, quite compared, a bit compared, to compared to past figures. Past figures. Yes, though that is though primarily, primarily because, because, because there are fewer scholars, scholars with research, with research needs. needs. But that can be a rather convoluted topic. Might I ask why you are here today? I believe you know this individual. His name is Ilyas. He worked part-time here, and he's here for his paycheck. Oh, yes, of course. Though, uh, Ilyas, where have you been these past few days? Getting experimented on by some guy. That was our busy period, but then you disappeared without a word. Everyone had to pick up the slack. Oh my god! <laughs> imagine being... Imagine being sick for this one. Oh boy. You say his full name like, instead of acting grand sage. It's like acting grandmaster. Or like Jean. Well, the only reason they're called Jean is like she's she's called Jean is because you know, Jean saw an intimidating buff man with a college degree. You know, I, I'm sorry, but we gotta admit, I'll hate them. It's fucking scary. <laughs> I'm sorry. Something unexpected came up, but I know I've caused trouble for everyone. Is there anything I can do to make up for it? <laughs> the other researchers have more or less finished your share of the work. However, there is one thing that is yet to be settled. Do you remember Chandra? You were in charge of following up on his off-site research application. I like how none of them are, like, willing to pitch in the fact that he was, you know, kidnapped. <laughs> like, everyone, like, all of them are just, like, watching his superior kind of berate him for, you know... Getting kidnapped? <laughs> he tracked his application a few days great ago people, and great people. his off-site project. Clap, 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 clap for the fucking pancake gallery, He's peanut gallery. The person to retract I want a research now. application this month. I'd like you to ask him why he did that. Mm, Chandra is probably having coffee at this hour, so Did they threaten him with violence? Cafe. Understood. This is like the real world. Oh, it's so uh, cruel uh, and kind of sad. I'll pay you in full once you return. However, make sure you don't disappear without saying anything again. <laughs> make sure you consider it to your colleagues and give them some forewarning at least. Hello, sir. Oh my gosh, I just got, I remembered. <laughs> I remember some. I remember. Okay, I laugh at it now, but this is actually really, really sad. This is a very harsh reality in in the academe and you know just in general work. You always have to notify if you, if something really bad happens to you. So I remember a friend of mine had COVID and she felt really, really bad. So the first thing that she did was she was already in the hospital. Um, she told me, hey, could you tell my gr our group mates that we're, I'm not going to be able to make it? And she's like, and I was like, oh, you good? Oh, yeah, I'm sick. And then she went on this whole like tangent and then showed me a picture of her in the hospital. I laugh now, but this is really sad. Oh, man. Oh, shit. Is that, that hurts. Acting Grand Sage Alhatham? Please tell me that he's going to say that to the guy that he was kidnapped. I have no objections. Sweet fucking lord! <laughs> have you no heart? <laughs> oh, here's the Lay of al -Hamar. I was wondering where you find that. Or the actual book. Oh, man. It's like when people get kidnapped and, the, and they get blamed for getting kidnapped instead of blaming the kidnapper. What the fuck? Why is it pitch wiped? Was the what? Wait, what? 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 What was that? <laughs> wait, what? Wait, 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 wait. Why was that book pitch wiped? This is the lay. This is something else. Yeah, this is the book of uh, Ahmar. And uh, I'll find it when I'll find it. <laughs> It's in the archive, yeah, but like, oh, it doesn't give you the physical book. That's sad. Go higher. Oh, go play the victim instead of the criminal. Like, when does that ever happen? Ridiculous! Truly. When 
are when's the victim being blamed for everything? What kind of monster would do such a thing? Oh, I have to message my parents to buy shakies, please. Can we have shakies? <laughs> I have a very high latency. Okay. Please, shakies. <laughs> Would do such a thing. Oh, what a shame. Not like criminals would pay the lawyers, am I right? Yeah. Not like criminals would also pay the judges, am I right? Ooh. Oh boy. Wait, where is this guy? Oh, I'm an idiot. Wee! Do do do. You know what's funny? Because of the latency, I actually like. I'm gonna be responding to your chats like a few seconds later. Should I turn? Should I? No, we will not be doing that. So I have a question: Are you guys pulling for El for for Kave and Baiji or not? I'm curious because Baiji is a very anticipated unit. I'm surprised. Hi, hi. I'm actually genuinely shocked that Baiji is not getting spotlight. In terms of the events. You know how the five stars usually are... Um... Wait, what? Where do I go? Quit following me. Wait, what? Do I go outside? Yeah. Right, sorry, my bad. Oh, yeah, it's sweet. But, uh... You know what's funny? Baiju isn't getting spotlight the same way that other five stars are. Which is weird. He is a busy man. <laughs> like, Kave got the spotlight. Which is kind of funny. <laughs> the four star got all the spotlight instead of um, the five star, which is very fascinating. Well, usually banners these days have one event related character and one that's just there. Yeah, but usually they put more effort on the five star getting that attention. Five stars are like, when was the last time that happened? Um, when it Dia got released in three point, was she five? Or four? Too no, she was five, right? Did we do a Sumeru related event? No, what was last? What was the event last time? Oh, I'm pulling for Kave. Yeah, I'm pulling for Kave. Hopefully, I get him on the first try. Hopefully, nothing bad happens to me. Hopefully, nothing bad happens to me, and I get Kave first pull. Okay. I hope nothing bad happens to me, and I get Kave. First, pull. Don't fucking do this to me, Genshin. Elias, long time no see. What well, that's a voice. I heard that you canceled your research project, so I'm just here to ask you why. Are you human? Oh, that, um, it's really nothing special. I, I just don't feel like going anymore. <laughs> Was he I'm threatened? Not the only one who canceled, right? I mean, uh, people have had no motivation to conduct research lately, haven't they? No motivation to conduct research? What? It's it's perfectly yeah. normal. Say, who might you be? You look sort of familiar. I am your superior, you degenerate. Pew pew. Hopefully. <laughs> oh, um, don't mind me. Please, continue. Oh, Hatham is such a background character that he's the kind of person that you might accidentally diss and then you'll just find out that he's part of the government. <laughs> well, with the downfall of the sages not long ago, many of the projects Used to be my major, I'm required to. <laughs> Plus, he looks like a Cavendish from One Piece. With the situation Cavendish being so from volatile, piece. people are picking up random things to do to kill time. No one wants to risk starting any new research until it's clear how things will pan out in the future. That is perfectly fair. And that's perfectly fair. Uh, as a research student myself, this is very, very true. I've seen way too many people that overcommit to a project without realizing just how little time they have and how many, how much responsibilities they have. Even as a content creator, I've seen this happen to so many people. I've been making videos for like two. I have three hundred thirty-seven videos. Whoa! What the fuck? Anyway. I will say this to you guys right now, like just a piece of thought, because this also happened to me before, uh, and this has happened to my colleagues. Passion is fine, and so is ambition. 
but always manage your resources and your time properly because just because you have a very strong vision and execution it doesn't mean that the world's gonna wait for you if you can't execute it on a deadline and you and the professor doesn't allow an, an extension take your l just just take your l okay just take your l submit what you can and this is very true. This is, this is sad. I was supposed to take a break from school. What the fuck? When you say how things will pan out, you actually mean what the new sages would have interest in, right? Well, yeah. I mean, yes. Wow. Talk about blunt. But that isn't the only reason for the lack of motivation to start new research. Yes, that's completely true. Adjusting based on what's popular in the academe is very much a thing. Unfortunately, yes, it is very much true. If the if the new craze is about uh, social media, because while well, social media is a very popular thing, then obviously you'd want to wait for trends. It, I'll hate them for being a dick. They don't want. <laughs> so what are the other reasons? Well, because the Akasha terminal shut down. No, no, the chat GPT. I'm sure you're all aware that we require all kinds of knowledge to perform any of the research we do. But there's a whole fucking library there. Actually, no, that's such a mood. The internet goes down for like two minutes and suddenly all of my- all- Everyone in my class is just like, We can't do our research because Ooh, there's no JSTOR Or ooh, there's no Science Hub Or ooh, Plyridel's gone All of the online journals are just gone But Mood Honestly, mood Honestly <laughs> Man, I wanted to go take some rest I didn't mean to rant about my academics here Back then, the Akasha would respond to any of our requests for the knowledge we needed just like the internet. It was beyond convenient. Oh, I turned your phone back. Yes, my room. Oh, really? This is so him? We I'm glad to see that he got more NPCs. Tests and experiments. I see. Oh, come on, you boomer. You get it, right? After having had a taste of something so amazing, who can be bothered to manually sift through data and files ever again? It's not him being lazy. I'll be honest with you. Like, even a physical library could never amount to the things that an Akash the Akasha Terminal had. This is a after chat DVD. <laughs> Imagine trying to do a research paper while not having the internet. Yes, it is possible, but yes, it is very time consuming. I had to do that before. I had to use like physical books. And the problem, my personal problem with the books is that one, they're very difficult. They're very, very difficult to procure. Like, the actual textbooks that I need. Like, on the surface, because the, the library can only give you so much. The library can only give you so much. So, to have the Akasha Terminal, have, like, the whole record of information and time, like, from the past is so important. Because, like, it's accessible. But it's also really good storage. And it's very extensive. Sure, you can read all the books, but look at the books in your library. Trust me, you're not gonna get much. Like, you know. Like, sometimes the books don't even cover the topics that you want to talk about. For example, like, I have a topic on Facebook. All of my, all of my RRL is from uh, online journals. Because I couldn't find, like, any physical book in my library that had a very intense uh, research into advertising. It was fascinating. Um, it was very sad. There are only a handful of people at the academia. Which quest are we doing? This is I'll hate them's quest because unfortunately research. I have Most to do all the like quests. This is something too close to home. To Guys, I'm gonna go order some Starbucks. Immediately applying to join. <laughs> Although our names will be further down in the paper, we'll have a much easier time. We don't and people learn just uncritically instead of pursuing their All own knowledge. Focus on our assigned tasks. Oh, that's true. This is uh, Akasha Terminal. It's more like a chat GPT. Yeah, instead of the internet. It's like TikTok. How's Dario, by the way? It's okay. It's pretty good. <sighs> Whoa. Genshin got, like, the glitching effects. They didn't used to have that. Oh my gosh, it's all coming back, it's all coming back to me now. It hurts. Oh, he's dying. F. L plus ratio bozo. Oh? I remember now. 
I remember what Siraj said to me as he approached. So the algorithm exists in Genshin? I don't doubt that. Yeah, the algorithm exists. You will become Siraj number 36. Ew! Fuse yourself with a consciousness under my control. Think only in accordance with a set module. Ew, it's like the Thara, but <laughs> creepier. Because he's not pretty. <laughs> what the hell? Wait, why would... Fuse yourself with a consciousness under my kitchen. Why would he name it Siraj number four? <laughs> All right. Paimon doesn't get it. What does that even mean? It's what Siraj was researching and the topic of the thesis he had submitted. Collective, Collective consciousness, consciousness in the path, the path of, evolution. of evolution. That's so dumb. The collective consciousness is such a... <laughs> I get to say this because I've I've had to do a research paper on the collective consciousness before. I had to I had to defend before. Uh, what did you do or what did I study? Oh, I I study communication. I study how people talk to each other. It's actually very fascinating. I have learned the hard way that people are monkeys. <laughs> the more you do research, honestly, the more you just go, well, there is conclusive evidence. Yes, we are monkeys. Monkey see, monkey do. And we just like to believe that we're not monkeys and we like to believe we're special. It's kind of hilarious, but you know. The collective consciousness is honestly a lie. So a Vahumana researcher? Yeah, probably. I can't remember what Vahumana researched. Hello, Ren. The collective consciousness is very much a lie. Yeah, the collective consciousness is a lie. Anyone that be genuinely believes that a collective consciousness is good for humanity is a uh, is questionable because um yes human freedom something 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 stupid like that the problem with the collective consciousness is that um there's only there's two ways that it can be done one is that you mirror the consciousness of people into other people's consciousness sis they, like, like what Siraj is doing he is you know he's a he's the one that's outside of the system but everyone else is the collective consciousness something like that the problem is that, well, what if the person that's controlling the collective consciousness is fucking stupid? You know what I mean? <laughs> the collective consciousness is really dumb. If the collective, the system that it exists on, or the, the uh, that it's patterned by, patterned on, is fucking dumb. <laughs> Siraj believed that by achieving three objectives, he could create, he can create a, a con consciousness yeah. and change society and drive He's humans stupid. towards their ultimate evolution. Boo! Boo Siraj! Unfeasible. Unfeasible and dumb. Hi, Salmala. Hello, everybody. Welcome to apparently Aster ranting about the research, the, uh, the, the academia. As a research student, this is hitting way too close to home for me. First, <laughs> he would rank test subjects in descending order of ability, with number one serving as the overmind. This is dumb. This overmind would then divide tasks into numerous, numerous modules, modules and delegate, and delegate them, to them to the collective members, members based on their, based assigned, assigned, on their assigned number. number. Yeah, the problem is though that the overmind could be inherently flawed. That's the problem with a human, uh, human consciousness. Lastly, members would share their memories and emotions to facilitate the rapid exchange of information within to the facilitate the rap Members would share their memories and emotions to facilitate the- So it's like AI. It's basically like AI. Algorithms learn from each other. That's how AI is work. So it's basically a really massive form of AI mixed with the the co collective consciousness, though. You're a good communicator, though. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> thanks, I guess. <laughs> but um, thanks. You're here to watch. Oh, okay, okay. I remember. Okay, that's what it's in reference to. Gotcha, gotcha. Thank you. I tend to ramble a lot about topics that I like. Biological AI, more like neural network. Neural networks are much more... Okay, okay, hi. Neural networks are... This is... Okay. AI is the game. Neural networks are the platform to play that game on. Something like that. It kind of does something like that. That's a... Um, it's, AI isn't completely neural network. But AI and neural network are not separate things. Something like that. So what he's doing is a neural network. But it's fundamental, you know, it's processing, uh, it's processing algorithm is kind of like an AI. Kind of, kind of, 
Kind of. Except he's using human beings. And I'll be honest with you. I'll be real with you guys. Humanity is very slow. <laughs> um, powering stuff with a human brain is actually really, really bad. <laughs> Sorry. I, I told you I had to do a I had to do an entire paper on defending why the collective consciousness is not a good thing. But basically, humanity has such a really bad pro uh, processing wise. It's really fast, but storage wise, it's very very limited, and it also depend like it's very very uh, unstable because human memories are one. They're not like computer data that is uh, a series of code. It's not a uh, this can be manipulated or something. Uh, it's very easy to manipulate human memories. You know, just like how we gaslight ourselves every day. Paimon still doesn't get it. What's the point of all that? All RAM, no hard drive. Is linking many minds together and tailoring a given mind's assigned work. Is that why we use horsepower? In a way. <laughs> Maybe when I'm trying to go fast somewhere, they're just. There. Eventually, <laughs> will be consolidated humanity, humanity gets slower like the more you need them to be faster. Yeah, humans got a lot. <laughs> humans aren't the best things. We are not super computer level guys. We got beaten at chess. What's a horsepower? Uh, sheer so fucking will. Let's go with that. That's, I, I guess that's like the best way to explain humans. that. It's superior to individual minds. No, it's not. Ugh. Squishing a whole bunch of people together. Paimon thinks that sounds horrible. Watch this be like a new plot point for like a new Genshin where they put. Ew, that's really creepy. They put human bodies together. Oh, that's creepy. It's just as all Haytham said. Damn, not creepy. Saraj Haytham. <laughs> gave all the test subjects different Food. numbers. Bigger numbers meant you had a lower rank. So your assigned tasks were less complex, such as being responsible for everyone's basic needs. Smaller numbers, Smaller numbers were, ranked, were higher, ranked higher, so you'd be given, you'd be more, given complex more complex assignments like planning for the future. Siraj referred to me as number 36, and I think that was a low-ranking number. Are you offended? Are you offended that the person that kidnapped you just thought you weren't good enough? <laughs> Um, okay. I also recall that Siraj said his plan was proceeding very quickly. And that the, that the hive would, would soon be, be complete. complete. Uh, sure. Oh, no. Then we gotta hurry. We have to stop him before it's complete. No. I tried my best, but that's all I can remember. I still can't recall where the cave is. I'm really sorry. It's okay, buddy. Take your time. You'll eventually remember it all. However, something doesn't seem right. Some details don't add up. Yeah. What's off? Everything. You were only designated as number 36? What a shame. From what I can see, your talents merit a smaller number. <laughs> Why are they talking about his position? In... <laughs> oh man, these people have different priorities. Holy mother of god, I'll hate them. Stop contributing to his Stockholm Syndrome. I'm not sure what Siraj's numbering system is based on. Can we please anyway, stop talking about the numbering Let's system? Go. Please, wait. <laughs> Guys. I heard you all talking about Siraj just now. Are you looking for him? Huh? Yeah, why? Do you know something? Well, Siraj is pretty popular as of late. I heard he's gained recognition from a lot of well-known researchers. Supposedly, he's a strong contender for being one of the next stages. There are yeah, many the who would give up everything to be a part of his research team. <laughs> oh my god, I just realized I'm nothing special though, so I doubt I'd get the opportunity. You know what? You know what, guys? Maybe I'm a Vahumana researcher, a Vahumana uh, student. You know, for all of my studies into the human psychology of communication and the analytics and the patterns and human speech and thought in a massive neural network called the internet. I wouldn't be surprised <laughs> if I invent to eventually just have to test on all of you. To be fair, this channel has was always a social experiment. So, damn son, I that it's it's all this this story quest has been a very eye-opening realization from yours truly. Maybe I am part of the problem. 
that said, maybe I, I do have people in my basement that I will eventually be conducting some synaptic Jonaki. studies on. If you're interested, you can try to find her. She's usually reading at the pavilion in the garden. I'm head out, need to catch some shed eye. It is 4 p.m. Aru. <laughs> Did I get coffee? I kind of want coffee. What do you guys eat for... Okay, so we call it merienda. A uh, snack, I guess? Uh, what do you guys eat for Too snacks? Slow. Oh. Oh, where am I? What did I trigger? Hmm. I was trying to remember. What else did we put on our shopping list? What quest is this? Oh, what a mouth-watering smell. Where did I, I come from? I the aroma of biryani and... Uh... We can still add it to the list. Oh, yes. Okay, I. Well, if it isn't the, what the traveler fuck? in Paimon, wasn't expecting to see you here. Huh? I right, will just play this continuously. Hello there. Oh, it's been quite a while. Huh? So you two are still hanging out together, dear? Didn't you say last time that you were gonna head back to the desert? <laughs> Where am I? I said I was going to resign from being her bodyguard. Not that our friendship was over. We're still the best of friends. Very good friends, according to history. The Halmayanis also still post jobs from time to time. Their pay is always generous, so me and the other mercs never pass them up. I told Dia to just stay at our place when she took one of those jobs a few days ago. My parents were delighted. They even said that it always felt like we were missing someone whenever Dia wasn't around. <laughs> that sounds like something they would say, all right. They're always so welcoming. Anyway, the job is already taken care of, so I was gonna head back to the brigade as soon as I finished a little shopping. But the master kept insisting, and I ended up staying for another day. You can stay for as many days as you want, Dia. Father hasn't even gotten around to treating you to his best dishes yet. <laughs> you know I'm not the kind of person to stay put in one place like that, my lady. Don't worry, though. There'll always be next time. What? She said they'll treat you to the best dishes! When the shaky people of the future analyzed in the relationship, they came that. to the conclusion that they were the best of friends. <laughs> but, but wait. Didn't you say last time that you would take me on a trip to the desert? Why don't you just take me with you today, when you leave? I? There are so many places I still haven't visited yet. I'm sorry, my lady, but no can do. There's still a few things I need to take care of back at the brigade. Besides, Aye. the desert hasn't exactly been the most peaceful place lately. Oh, come on. Not this again. That's also what you said last time and the time before that. I know. I'm sorry. Just give me some more time, and I promise I'll plan the best trip ever for you. We're still talking. All right, fine. Let me go. To be perfectly honest... It's not that I wanted to go, it's more like... Something I feel is... like something is off about you lately. Aww. Ever since you first set foot on the estate a few days ago, you've been acting anxious and even paranoid. Oh? Have you been delaying our trip because you've run into some kind of trouble? N nah, are you kidding? You're worrying too much. She just isn't liking... you like swear you. on that? Friends shouldn't lie to each other, you know. I wouldn't pry any further if you're willing to swear on what you just said. He just isn't if like you. If something really is bothering you, then just tell me. You know I'll help you however I can. She's still mm. talking. Let me go. Oh, looks like Junior's ad was onto something. You're too perceptive, my lady. Seems I can't hide anything from you. Oh, let me go. I just thought that nothing good could come out of telling you about the messy happenings of mercenaries. Knowing too much only leads to more trouble. Mercenary life is a doggy dog Skip. world where more of That doesn't change anything about what I just said, though. Skip. We're still friends. Let me go. Always... My lady. You're not gonna stop until you drag it out of me, are you? Let me go. All right. I'll share what I Let's know. go back to beating the people Let's that do somewhere. research. Ah, we're gone! Okay. We're free! No! Just try not to draw <laughs> me attention. Let me go! Know, 
The Aramites have both a lot of, a lot of mercenaries, mercenaries and a complex and organizational, organizational structure. structure. Many mercs are no different Many than me, just going around looking for jobs. Let me go! We're not a large group, but, but every member is loyal and brave. However, However not, not all Aramites' brigades, brigades are like mine. mine. Some are willing to cross Some all kinds of lines for the sake of Mora. The most notorious is a faction known as Deshret's Relics. Deshret's Relics? Judging from the name, when the night really look up to is gone. <laughs> Corporate wants you to tell the difference between these two images. <laughs> yep, you got it. I've heard that you've already crossed. <laughs> what was the point of that? <laughs> oh, you mean the group that tried to sell us the divine knowledge capsule? Yeah, they weren't friendly at all. Deshret's relics and is composed of many smaller brigades is like Ayn al Akhmar. And the lad was bright. Want nothing to do with and them. the moon. Unfortunately, though, is the, the only brigade that's stirring up trouble now we'll is none other than. Hurry up! The Khan? The Khan? The Khan? Uh, I think it means beard or something. Believe me, it's a really stupid name. No, I, I won't. It. Anyway, the real Be issue afraid. is that the Khan al is led by my father, Kusela. Say what now? Oh, I think her I'm father's alive. To understand your anxiety Whoa. now. But what did they do? Not pretty things, details, apparently. My lady, but they've been involved in a lot of violent incidents. We're talking hundreds. Yeesh. <laughs> yep. The scenes tend to be quite gruesome, too. They strip the strip victims, victims of all their, of all their valuables, valuables before from... murdering them. Not only have Yeesh. they targeted merchant caravans and ordinary citizens, but other mercenary brigades as well. That's beyond terrible. They won't even spare their own kind. I don't know how Dashad's relics all says it. All I do know is that Dakana Akmar has become more and more aggressive over the last few years. There's a K in there? If I don't do something about them, then even my brigade or the people of Aru Village could become their next target. Yes, they can be. I just wish I knew what's driven <laughs> Let me go. this. Yeah. How can your father I don't know. Let me go. People change. He's always been pretty <sighs> pathetic. I just want to go back to this to the Al Heap of Star Quest. I mean, if he was even, he was even remotely, remotely decent, decent, then why would then I why would I have to he was loud and foolish. <laughs> it just no keeps on going. Instead of doing anything useful, he spent most of his time. Of course, I'm sorry, but I want to go back to the human like experiments. Him. They're rugged. Sounds like a nightmare. What about your mother? Did she ever step in to stop them? Was she killed? Unfortunately, I never knew my mother. Oh, it would be even more fucked up if she did and she was like murdered. Uh, oh, um, I'm sorry, Dia. I, I didn't know. Can I just say that I really love Dunyar's design? I really wish that she didn't have the NPC face, but her design is so pretty. It's all right, my lady. That's pretty common in mercenary circles. Didn't Hi, I Errol. That my father, we are. I'm trying to sure get through this because was. I want to get back to the and in any case, human experiment. He never came to see me. He'd say, "You'll be fine as long as you remember to stick with Dad." But even and then, even he left then, most of the debris. He left most of the debris. But the problem was that <laughs> he had terrible taste. If you love me, Nobody let me go. Even, there were tales of desert warriors defeating dragons in the forest, or stories of mercenaries. If you love me, let me go. <laughs> More or less, yeah. I they were I can't skip it completely because I actually kind of want to, you know. But after about I kind of want to see what's happening. They started to get a little. He seemed but to think it's just going. Were the best things ever, though. He was so into him that he'd call the whole brigade over and make them and make them perform, perform the, even the toys he gave me would all be story props. Soon the story will be good. It will helmets, be. I know that Dia's story quest is really good. Swords. It was only much. But I'm in the middle of something. That the shows were more for him than they ever were. Well, the stay as a vod. Yeah. I learned that guy. they make more money easy. Kappa. And it doesn't sound like he had all bad intentions. Yeah, I've always found him pretty childish. But that was something that I could just shrug off. I don't reason to despise until him. I grew until I grew up, up and learned and the true face of Deshret's relics for myself. Looting, blackmail, blackmail violence, violence, and fraud. They not fraud. only accepted such heinous acts, they but they would openly boast about them. Acts. Sounds like no a... No one in the brigade was any kind of hero. Instead, my father Instead, and his cronies were more like bad downs. My father and his cronies were more like the bad guys that needed to be taken down. At least he was a good dad. Did they really think that as long as they didn't do any of that stuff right in front of me, I would never know? I think he was I a good dad. I can understand your feelings. The difference between the difference perception. between perception and reality must have hit hard. Yeah. It's still going. Don't worry, my lady. 
It's all water under the bridge to me now. I had a huge argument. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I can't even skip this one. Place <laughs> I'm not investigating them due to any bitter feelings I still have towards my Yeah. Wait, I let me the do this. Together. I see. Uh, uh, but it is. But every that may be true. But it'll be impossible. As there is a new Sarah. Not to worry. Well, okay. I'm going to need to skip this. I'm sorry, Dia. I love you. Huh? I love your character. No need for but I need to get back to the human experimentations. He went into the desert with you. It was a very fascinating I'm story. <laughs> I'll wait for news. We will have your we will have your sad story and sob story I'm later. That you can All right, then let's get moving. Caravan Our first Ribot. stop will be Caravan Rebot, where we can catch up a bit with my fellow Mercs. Why does that sound just? Oh no! Okay, 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 okay. Let me go. Let me go. I'm free. I'm free. I'm free. Where is it? Where is it? Um, here it is. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. What else do I need to finish? I'm actually curious. Wait. Genshin not being able to multitask their characters is so questionable. <laughs> I don't know why. We'll have to meet Dia after that chat. Yeah, okay, so she's like really far away. Too slow. I'm pro okay. I'm probably going did you finish the quest or just start? This is Dia's quest. Uh this is I'll hate them's quest because apparently I have to finish hate them. So uh what do you call this? I'm going to... The VOD's gonna be something else. To play test tonight. Wait, what? It's not tonight? Don't gaslight me! Relax. Oh, okay, okay. I was about to say. Are they gaslighting me? Deactivating this, you can start others without the hassle. Okay. Yeah, honestly, why can't Genshin just have a deactivating story quest? Okay, the thing is, I wouldn't activate it if the keys weren't, you know, limited to three over three. Can't you just quick play it? No, I can't. Apparently not. Apparently not, because Genshin didn't think of their other system where they had characters. Um, I don't know why. I don't know why. It's just that chat you'll have after done done your free to finish the world event class. I only need to finish Nilu's and I'll hate them, so that should be quicker, right? Quit following me. If you love me, let me go. I don't know where he is. Where's the yellow brick road? Don't tell me that he's up. Don't tell me I'm going the completely different way. Oh, fuck. If you love me, let me go. Ah! Laggy? Yes, it is laggy. I haven't gotten a new PC yet. There's actually- it's Take actually it another reason why I haven't been streaming often because I haven't- I didn't get a new PC yet. And, um... This one's like eating- didn't you say you wanted to stop playing for some time? Yeah, I did. And that was like a-, a f and then that's the reason why... Um... <laughs> that's the- that's perfectly the reason why these are still not yet done. And these are not done at all. I will be doing Hazos one day. I will love to have a date with Hazo. Easy. Maybe. Allegedly. Hello, Janaki. Janaki. Hey, Janaki. We'd like to ask you a couple of things about Siraj. Yeah, my stream's usually known for being super laggy. What the? Yes? Do you know me? I'm sorry, but I don't recognize you. L plus ratio are you bozo. Playing dumb with me? That was not the voice that I thought. Okay. No, I'm not. 
I, I actually have amnesia, so I've lost a lot of my memories. And? <laughs> Are you trying to say that I should forgive you just because you've forgotten what you've done? Uh huh. Uh huh. Or are you using the acting grand sage as backup to settle things with me? The two biggest loners teaming up. <laughs> what a damn thought. That could be grounds for execution, no? That's enough. There seems to be a dispute between the two of you, but I have no interest in that. My brother in Christ, why is he collateral? I heard that Siraj once invited you to join his project. Is that true? Damn, so, son! He got fucking murdered! Siraj did extend an invitation to me, and I was also interested in his project. I think it was about collective consciousness or something. Anyway, he said that I could be number 45. I refused, because I thought that rank was too low. These people! These people, I swear, these people deserve to be part of the human experimentation and collective consciousness because they're just so damn stupid. I now understand. Maybe Siraj was onto something. Maybe there's a reason that he picked these bonobos into his, like, uh. Maybe there was, maybe he had a good reason. Maybe they deserved to be, you know, put in the bonobo box. I understand now. I, 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 I see. I see. I understand. I got it. Gotcha. Look at these people. Why are they your priority? No one wants to be placed at the bottom. <laughs> Certainly not me. Certainly. I wouldn't want to be put in the bottom of the human experimentation priority. Jesus. Elias is number 36, and Janaki was supposed to be number 45. Ugh. Just how many people did Siraj have his eyes on? I like how I like how Siraj like kidnapped the other guy, but asked for consent for her from her. <laughs> tell me, did Siraj tell you how he assigned numbers? Yeah. Remember how the sages took advantage of the Akasha and extracted Yana energy from our heads back then? Yeah. They left a document that records the amount of Yana energy that the Akasha had extracted from each person. I don't know how Siraj got his hands on that. Is document, that but is it just like it as the basis are you that stupid? Is that is that is that the case? Higher higher Yana means that mm, you have more left. I see. He believes that this data can be used to evaluate a person's computing power. That's very useful. I would like to see that in real life. I wonder if we already have that. Putting aside the validity of the data, it is meaningless to judge individuals based solely on their Nyana energy. At yes, most, it is, but you know. Yana energy can only be seen as representing a portion of a person's abilities. Humans are complicated beings, so it is impossible to evaluate them using a single criterion. Yes, exactly. That's why you shouldn't say that I'll hate them as nothing but abs. <laughs> See? I knew I couldn't have only been ranked as 45. Yeah, you were ranked you know higher, supposedly. <laughs> You were ranked higher, supposedly, but unfortunately, uh, because of the other criterion, surely personality was not part of, you know, that statistic that made you, uh, higher. Couldn't have helped you there, buddy. That's it. He came to me, I refused, and that was the end of it. Oh, he didn't kidnap you? Unlike this other guy? <laughs> Is there anything else you needed? If not, I'm out of here. I've had enough of this eyesore. A part of me is thinking that this guy wasn't actually kidnapped. Please wait, I, I... I still want to know what I did in the past. You really forgot? I swear, He's not so old. I don't remember anything. Paimon can vouch for him. The mantra also said that he truly lost his memories. Oh, but sad. I see. You know what? It's better this way. Ooh. I get angry just thinking about it. <laughs> so you really don't have the patience to fill you in. Oh my All god. You, you got a lot of people in trouble back then, including me. That's all I have to say. Goodbye. <gasps> Damn. Bitch. Okay. Slay, pop off. And she's gone. Flattened. She doesn't seem to like you very much. Do you really not remember anything? What the hell did you, you do? 
But after she said that, I've had this heavy feeling in my chest. Dude, what if he was I just a criminal? A criminal. Criminal. Did something really the... horrible. Yes, Do probably. You want to remember? Huh? Even though you're a witness against Siraj in this case, you've also lost your memory. No one can force you to remember if you don't want to. Even if you manage to remember, all you would need to do is feign ignorance and tell us that you tried the best you could, but to no avail. Ooh. I'm not sure what to do. It sounds like, like what Korean is called Ajuma. For some Ooh, what's reason, that? I felt a sense of freedom when I realized I had lost my memories. This has very strong parallels with Wonder's story, huh? But I feel like I shouldn't be allowed to go free so easily. I still want to remember everything. What should I do? I can look up your file. Something that caused trouble for a lot of people in the past must be on file somewhere. Would you like me to look into it? No. Yes, please. All right, then let's return to the house of Dana. We've spent enough time here, and you should go and get your paycheck. <laughs> get that bag, bro. Hey, them knows what's up. Just got the money. I'm glad to see that, you know, he has priorities. I'm glad to see that that's the case. And that he has very, very strong priorities. <laughs> oh my gosh. I would just like to remind all of you that currently our mission is to get this man paid. God, what a mood. God, what a mood. Just like to say that um, right now our goal, our final goal of everything is to make sure that um, this guy gets paid. You know, we don't, ha we don't want uh, any unpaid internships here. Snitch. Genshin paying attention to certain serial themes constantly. Give more of that, yes. Whee! Old lady compared to the other voices, yeah! You really don't remember. This is really far. Oh, that, never mind. I, I've, I went too far. You really don't remember. I am Mona Magistus, the great astrologist Mona. Whoa, that's frame rate drops. Have to pay respect for the frame rates. We, you lived a good life, dude. I played Genshin on my dad's PC, um, and it was. Uh, Quit following me. The quality was so good. My dad has such a bomber PC. I would love to, to buy a new PC, but I realize that half of my documents are here and I'm just like, wait, I need to make sure that they all get backed up first before I do something stupid. Are you going to turn this vid, vid into a stream? A VOD? Uh, sure. Wait, let me just like wait for this to settle. Okay, my frame rates are fixed. I think this event is more like a cave story quest. Vids vid drops harder than my iPad would think. The thing is, right? What do you call this? OBS is kind of a a fascinating creature. OBS will massacre any PC that it's on. I will not be doubting that. I can play Genshin Impact perfectly fine, but when I open OBS, God help America. Um, okay. I have used church streams before. I saw eating Let's a lot split of up for now. True. Ilias, you go and deal with that. The rest of you come to the archives with me. We'll meet back here later and then head over to Gandarva. Yeah, it's super rare for me to play Genshin, right? <laughs> okay. Thank you all so much. Relax, Ilias. Being nervous accomplishes nothing. That's true. 
<sighs> I'm ready. No matter I'm what ready. I've done, I'm ready to face it. I'll also try my best to remember anything else related to Siraj. We'll put an end to all of this. Watch, he's that. actually Siraj. See you Joke. later. It's Kappa. Bye bye. A thorough investigation. What? Oh. Oh, right. He's like, he has the, he has an office. Do I want Jamaican patty or do I want something crispier? I want to eat something that's crispy, but I don't know what I should be eating. Maybe I should just eat egg. Cheese. It sounds good, but I don't know what to, I don't know what to eat. Relax. I kind of want chicken. <laughs> chicken sandwich. Ah, it sounds so heavy. KFC with rice sounds like a meal. Hmm, we'll see. Oh, I'll hate them. I'll hate them. Al. Okay. The. <laughs> the important files from the last few years should all be here. Uncooked noodles? Oh, I've already had that yesterday, so I'm trying to get something better. There are many vacancies for stages and a number of suspicious people spreading various. Various using. Oh. Okay. Uh, the Taoist Darshan has also had an abundance of weirdos. Recently, there is a new rumor that to say Raven's type thesis. Damn. The Layla Slander. Wandering around Parity at night. The investigation shows. Who's that Wander? Damn. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, wait, no, it's not Wander. Anyway, I found a <laughs> Wait. This is gonna be kind of funny if like, the shadow is actually just like Wander. Cause he just, I, cause he doesn't sleep. What have I done? <laughs> Arson, <laughs> identity theft, attempted murder, <laughs> blackmail, conspiracy, working against the government. <laughs> It's all written on your file, buddy. This file indicates that you were once commended by the Academia for your courage and sense of justice. You were considered a hero. Were? Huh? Me? Yes. Your instructor was engaging in academic fraud, and you were the one who reported him. Is it Karkata? The report was found to be true after a series of Is it? Which is a wandering shadow. And your instructor was brought to justice by the Matra. This incident caused quite the commotion, and the Academia sent you a commendation. <laughs> what is it? Are any memories coming back to you? Me when I get no, any compliment. Just... <sighs> My head feels like it's being ripped apart again. It hurts. Did I seriously do that? Then why? Let's put this matter aside for now. It isn't directly related to Siraj, so there's no need to push yourself over it. Aww. I'm sorry. Oh, Kakata's only allowed out and about at it night. Something good to oh, hear, but my body I, is instinctively I didn't think they let him out. <laughs> out if I try to remember. Take it slow. Foster for my imposter Recovery syndrome is hurting. Is no easy task, especially when it involves memories that you don't want to remember. Just do what you think is right. Thank you. I'm not sure how you're so calm and composed all the time, but it does make me feel more confident about the situation I'm in. Let's He's like Craig Tucker. And deliver Ilias's paycheck to his sister. Come on. He's just he's Oh, I just realized. I hate them's Craig Tucker from South Park. <laughs> Too slow. Let's think through this logically. We don't need to we don't need to panic. Let me go. I made a mistake. I did not want to go out. Um. Oh, I have to go to Gundarvaville. Never mind. All the effort to build something like Harkata when there's Catherine. Okay, you know what's funny about the Catherine situation? A lot of people like were like, oh, Catherine's a robot. Myself included. My I I am people. I am people. Um. Everyone was like, oh my gosh, she's a robot. <gasps> she's working for the Fatui. And then, like, when it's actually revealed, it was like, oh, yeah, I'm, I'm a robot. And now that I'm really thinking about it, 
I don't think anyone in Tivat really cares because I feel like everyone knows that Catherine's a robot. It's just the traveler in Paimon doesn't know she's a robot because they're new. You know what I mean? It's like... <laughs> I feel like if you told someone that Catherine's a robot and everyone's just gonna be like, Yeah? We know? Did you really think that she's everywhere at once and that's human? <laughs> it's like, yes, Alexa is a robot. Mm hmm. Siri is a robot, yes. Uh, uh, got anything else for us today? And <laughs> if Catherine would be playable. It's a whole arm with Catherine. Too slow. We should be close. Let me think. It should be this way. Okay. Oh, the frame rates! You good, buddy? Yes. What are you doing back here? Alright, let's have the frame rates kind of catch up. Oh, there you are. Thank you. Dad. Uh, it's nothing. I was just wondering how everyone was doing. You sure everything's okay? Did they bully you again? It's a right. You can tell us. <laughs> Did they bully you? What's wrong? Uh, I'm fine. Just a minor headache. <laughs> if Wander and Albedo can receive a vision, there's absolutely no reason for Catherine to not be able to receive a vision. Back then, I told you not to be a hero. Look how things turned out. Oh, did he try to save them? I can't imagine how things are going for you at the Academia. We've even been receiving threat letters. I mean, the thing is that... Okay, even if Alexa and Siri are things in our world, people still want to learn about creating their own robot. That's the thing. What do you call this? It's not like one. I don't think anybody... Like, it's a headquarters in Sajnaya. We can't exactly ask Elon Musk how to build a... Build a... You know... About our science project, kind of like that. So it doesn't really, uh, it doesn't really stop um, in, uh, individuals to make their own thing because one, for the sake of knowledge, and two, is that uh, what do you call that? Will all Catherine receive a vision? No, I feel like it's only one person, right? It has to only be one person. Only one of them gets to have the vision if they get the vision, right? Kind of like that. You don't have to force yourself to stay at the academia. You can always come back home. Oh, that's so creepy. I'm alright. I just need a little rest. No, he yes, doesn't. doesn't. seem like he wants them to know that he has amnesia. He doesn't want his family to worry. Hey, hey! That's enough, you two! Ilyas isn't feeling well. You can keep nagging him once we get home. Ilyas, let's find somewhere to talk. Bye-bye. So, how's your headache? It's much better now. Oh, here. It's this month's paycheck. How's everything at home? Same old, same old. It's just that everyone's worried about you. Don't mind their nagging. Deep down, they know that you did the right thing. Did it's they? It's just that after hearing a lot of bad rumors about you and seeing all the threatening letters... Well, their mom and dad. Maybe they just want you to... conform a bit more. Oh Conform. no! Conformity. Yeah. Are you free to play? No, of course not. After the incident, you not after I sold my soul to try and see six Tezo, but get a C six Kazo instead. I will forever be livid by that. God did. God was not kind to me that day. Oh, I see. I remember now. Uh, don't worry. I remember now. You're acting a little weird today. You know. Anyway. I understand your decision, but Mom, Dad, and I just want you to be happy. I don't care if you're a hero or not. I just want you to enjoy life and relax more. Your Aww. understanding is a great comfort to him. Is it? That's good. Are you a friend of his? <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, everyone's just gonna be like, Oh, hello, mister. Who is this man? More so these two. I have no My name is Oliver, The Traveler has not and this is the traveler no, 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 no. Oh, Thank you for talking to us about us. At any rate, 
I feel more at ease knowing that my brother has friends. Would you like to join us for dinner? I just buy some extra food. Helpless bozo. Sorry, but I still have things I need to take care of. Well, that's a shame. Aww. Okay, I'll get going then. Take care of yourself, Ilias. Bye bye. Don't worry. I won't do anything to make you guys worry again. You remember now? Yes, I do. Thanks for that. You know, you don't seem like such a bad person. Allegedly. Is that your way of conveying gratitude? Oh, my apologies, but I meant every word. Remember when I asked at the tavern if we had ever met? Mm -hmm. I said that there was hey, a buddy, sense Fischl. of familiarity, but what I really meant was a sense of loathing. Loathing? Mood. Mood. Yeah, but having spent some time with you, I realized that you're not someone I dislike to that extent. Strange, isn't it? Pretty Why strong. Did I have I those mean, thoughts at that time? Yeah, the traveler can most likely get a vision. What's stopping gods from just like chucking a rock at him? My strength is that I don't care about what others think. <laughs> if you could also develop this quality, then you won't be as bothered by complicated social relationships. Is he smiling? Is he smiling or have I just like have I just gone insane? It'd be great if I could think like you. <laughs> uh, but first things first. I remember where Siraj's cave is now. I'll take you there. I see the word autistic thrown a lot in my comment section. It is a very strange topic that I will not be diving into. Really? That's great! If there's not part of Tivat, but what about the like since the Airman's Souls records of here? One, right? Hmm. Probably. What about the if a creature is from Tivat, maybe they 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 can get the visions. Because honestly, like the the rules of Tivat don't apply to There either. are more important things at hand. We have to stop Siraj before he completes his collective consciousness, or it'll be too late. Thank you, Hassan. You're right. Let's head out. Giggity giggity. <laughs> Into the thick of it. Into the thick of it. Into the thick of it. Why are you make? When are you making a video on the nave? I just finished on Il Dathore. There's eleven of them. She will get back when she gets back, because there's something about the red X's that I need to find a bit more information about. I need to know about the the age the, the Asians, the Asians, not the Asians. No, not the Asians. Never mind, what was I talking about? That's fine. I feel like I kind of used it because I have autism. But I'll stop addressing the topic. Not really. It's not really uncomfortable. It's more like I see a lot of people say autistic coded. As someone that has no idea what that means, um, I'm just very curious. What do you call that? I'm, I'm just very curious about that topic. It is strange because, like, what do you call this? But for example, for, for me, like he was uh, just working as someone that didn't have, uh, that just had amnesia. But as someone, uh, but if you're someone that relates to him, I guess, as someone that has autism, then you will you will definitely see that in that context. It's just very fascinating. That what do you call this? I don't know. I have been accused of like, <laughs> I've been accused multiple times of saying um, because I did a character analysis on Nahida. Uh, I was accused by someone saying that um, I was saying that autistic people are, e are are what do you call that are evil or dangerous by nature, and I just kind of stared at that comment. I was like, I didn't even know that she was autistic coded, and I I, I was I was like, oh? <laughs> I was so confused. <laughs> I was so confused because I honestly related to Nahida, and I don't have autism, so. Um, I, I wouldn't know. I haven't seen a psychiatrist ever. I can just interpret them so many. Yeah, that's the thing. Interpretations in literature is very dangerous and sometimes it can be accidental, it can be not. I don't know what it means and I the thing is like I am not qualified enough to make any comments on it. I'm just going to say this that that video was not meant to be me saying that autistic people are dangerous because I wouldn't know. 
And I don't think I've ever been punched by one. This is the place. <laughs> Fix documents when I should one day. It's so well hidden. He is very little about God to be each bad luck and being dealt as and being dealt a bad hand sometimes. Yeah. Nahida got the short end of the stick when it comes to godliness. And by short end of the stick, I mean very, 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 very short help. I, I what do you call that? She reads a lot, a lot of help. Sure, let's just go with this team. <laughs> I'm too lazy to swap out of anyone's teams. It's a very fascinating thing, exactly. People always say that they have autism and we have being nice. Yeah, I don't want to talk about... Um, the reason I don't want to talk about autism, depression, anxiety is because I'm not qualified. It's very irresponsible for me to talk about that, especially as a... Uh, especially as a as a research student and someone that very... Uh, that takes evidences and sources very seriously. I don't think I'm... Um, it is okay. I actually had like a lot of people also ask me about mental illnesses in Genshin, and I, w I would just like to say this before we continue with the story quest. Please never try to diagnose me with anything. I I, I beg. Still a work in progress. I beg of the. It is very irresponsible to try to diagnose an internet personality of anything. I'll be honest with you. It is. Very, very bad. It is a- it is a bad, bad call. Don't do it, guys. This is Alhitham's story quest. I actually will change the thumbnail because this is Alhitham's story quest and... Unfortunately, I have to finish all of these. <laughs> I diagnosed you with BASED. <laughs> really have to think twice before speaking anything nowadays because people- can, Why can't people just chill? It, you can people get offended for anything like sometimes it's very valid right like the the criticism is valid sometimes I and when the criticism is valid I respond to it but sometimes it's not and you just kind of go damn this looks like a League of Legends lobby do you play Genshin on mobile if so which phone no my mobile will literally turn into a, a radioactive weapon hmm. I am not that allowed to play <laughs> Genshin on my phone Did he get separated from us? Should we wait here or turn around and look for him? Did you bring the guy that escaped? Did you? Why'd you bring him? Why'd you bring him here? Why'd you bring Elias here? There's no need for that. Let's keep moving. Uh, all right. We'll continue in and see if he catches up to us. We're just gonna leave him to like wander this place? Seriously? <laughs> He's gonna die. No offense, but. <laughs> Kali's bombs. Whoa. Whoa! Genshin cinematic! Whoa! It's okay, Ilyas. You've done more than enough for me already. I don't understand. Everyone knows that Johnny is stealing your research. Why is no one willing to go public with the truth? He shamelessly used your thesis to send in a project application. And whenever the project hits a wall, he asks you for help. Everyone knows what's going on. Do you know how many people are working on that project? If Johnny was kicked out because of academic fraud, that'd be the end of the project. Too many people would be affected. But he's obviously taking advantage of you! Ooh, this hits way too close to home! <laughs> As a student! This is hitting way too close. He throws you the hardest work, and after you're done pulling all-nighters, he struts around with your research data and takes credit for it. I'm really sorry, I can't watch any more of this. It's not right! Why are you putting up with this? A lot of people warn me to not say anything, and I think they have a point. This is just how things are. All I want is to graduate <laughs> without any problems. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck. I don't want to watch this. This is hitting way too close to home. It's okay. He's at least paying me. I don't want to watch this. This is way this is hitting way too close to home. Oh fuck. Half a year of your time and effort. Countless <laughs> all-nighters and casual threats and insults. He's treating people like cattle. 
Enough. It's fine. I just need to suck it up and get it done. Fuck! That hurts. Sheesh! Oh, fuck. Woo! Sheesh! Huh? You could read minds this whole time and you never told Paimon? Yes, Paimon, I'm actually the Benjoricon. Of course not. I was also able to see those memories just now. They were probably the ones that leaked out while Ilios was connecting to the collective consciousness. Jeez! Connecting... collective consciousness? It's clear that this place isn't a work in progress. The hive has long been finished. Oh! The collective consciousness project is already complete, and Ilios is now returning to the collective. So he tricked us. Wait, monkey see, monkey do? Not entirely. Keep walking and you'll see why. Don't shout F word, please for... Why in the world are you... Um, don't you think you should be watching YouTube with... Earphones? Uh... Good on you, buddy. F to pay respect. Ooh. Ooh, mechanics. Oh, shit. Wait, what? Oh. Ah. <laughs> what? If you were into bot, would you, would you enroll in the academia? I would love to say no, but the answer is yes. What's my favorite character gameplay-wise? Uh, Scaramouche. I like flight and I like kiting. Those are very fun things. <laughs> Hmm... Puzzle will make brain hurt. Aster has not had food. Oh, we have to... Oh, what a pay-to-win mechanic! Ugh! So pay-to-win! <laughs> oh, we don't have that. I, w I forgot we don't have that. Wait. If you're to run that kind of starship, would they join? Wait, how do we go through this? Strange. That doesn't seem right. Hmm. Maybe we need to use two keys at once. You can have more of them. Oh. Thanks, Paimon. Very pog. Thank you, backseaters. Very nice. Hmm, <laughs> I now remember why I dislike streaming. Behold. Quit following me. Uh excuse the chest. Oh, sorry, precious. The wind rises. Upon the gale. Up, 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 up. Hmm. <laughs> Too slow. It's if you want to know what streamers rules about backseating, just genuine. Uh, just like uh, what do you call this? Streamer, streamer etiquette. They will ask if they want the device. Uh, something like that. YouTube doesn't have like a pinned message, like a pinned message, uh, the rule system strengths. properly, so, you know. How easy. It's fine. Collective consciousness. Hello. I want to see like a massive place where all the physical bodies are just oh, hey, <laughs> chained up just to each other. Just thinking that name fills me with hatred. We must get rid of him. We must get rid of him. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Truly, truly, truly. After this quest, I'm not sure. After after this, the Arkham quest, I don't want anything to do with the Academia, but knowing me, I'd probably, you know, I'd probably strive to get into the Academia. How much is it, though? Like, the thing is, right, I don't know if other places have other schools. Like, 
That's the thing. Probably like, you know, zero in front of hers to make you think she's weak, but in reality, she's insanely powerful because of her ex An entire powers. year's oh worth God. of work down the drain. And for what? Your reputation? Do you have any idea how many people you brought down? You could have played Hero any time. So why couldn't you have waited until the project was complete? Wait, I know this name. I don't understand what you guys are saying. Are you saying you don't care that Raju jumped to his death? What the fuck? Whoa! Whoa! It's a shame. What happened to him? I, I thought he was stronger than that. Jesus! <laughs> Whoa! Everyone has been working hard to complete the project. He could have endured for a bit longer. But he chose now of all times to... Oh, this hits way too close to home. I don't think I should be streaming this. In any case, we're done with you. Oh, because fuck. This hits way too close to home. Johnny on trial. Oh, this project is done for. This hits way too close to home. This is... Whoa, this hits way too close to home. None of this affects you at all. But do you know how many people... Myself included, needed this project to complete their studies. Now our futures are up in the air. If worst comes to pass, we might not be able to graduate. Do you understand now? Oh, shoot, I kind of need a, a minute for that. Neats. Neat. I'm sorry. No, don't be! <laughs> Fuck! There's no need for an apology. It's not like I'll accept it anyway. You'll pay for this. Jesus, that was physically uncomfortable. Fuck. Okay, fuck. Ah, uh, that is unsettling. That's very unsettling. That's very unsettling. Hey, you're blinking out again. What did you see this time? Record reacting up. I'll probably just like, keep this. Don't jump to conclusions just yet. Oh, I'll probably Save stream the events for when we see him. <laughs> that sucks. That hits way too close to home. I don't know if it's a good idea to talk about this on stream, but since Genshin already talked about it, this is very real. I... Uh... I probably shouldn't talk about it. I'll be... I'll... It, it, it wouldn't be a good idea. Ooh, a trigger warning! <laughs> Jesus Christ. I really, I really want to get this quest over done, done over with. That was, that was, whoa. Just in case, why don't we take both keys with us? Thanks, Paimon. Very pog. Uh. Quit following me. Huh. Maybe even too close. Oh. Huh. Too slow. Is there a way that I can put it inside? Oh, I can. Quit following me. Wait. Too slow. I did not see it. There was like something else in the back. Where is it? This is the original. What? This is the original door. This is the other one. Ooh. Okay, here's the thing. I really, really, really don't want to say this. But this is very normal. The thing is... Uh, I've already seen it happen. What the? Did I just glitch? Did you see that? Okay, I'll, I'll talk about this later, but... Ooh. Well, Alias, this is all very strange. Is there really no research group that will take you? Oh, that's so sad. Well, to pass this course, you must complete a paper with other researchers. 
I know you're a hero for fighting academic fraud, but well, we can't make exceptions for heroes, now can we? Oh, this is really difficult. Maybe you should try to improve your relationship with the other researchers. Huh? Getting a reputation for being too unconventional will not stand you in good stead in the long run. I understand. <sighs> You seem troubled. Oh. Who are you? Ah, where are my manners? He looks my cool. Name is Sirash. Sirash, I've heard of you before. Do you need something from me? Mm, the world hates people who don't fit in. I imagine you've had your fair share of trouble. After you reported Johnny for academic fraud, you are ostracized and shunned. Even your family can't understand your actions. Oh, However, man. I'm working on some research that will help you merge into a collective. That way, <laughs> your life won't be so Hong Kong How about it? Want to have a go? Oh, man. But Eskius, this is his Hatham's. Uh. What did you see? Siraj persuaded to join the hive. I can't believe it! He really did trick us! That giga jerk! He didn't remember. No, Siraj is the real giga jerk here! Ilias, Ilias is, is just a regular jerk! jerk. Ooh, Paimon's so mad! We're gonna find him and we're gonna make him explain himself! Oh man. This Robocop guy. Oh man, okay. I'll save my thoughts. My many, 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 many thoughts. After this. Because I don't think I'll be able to do the quest. The, the event quest today. I have things that are planned and I realize that I don't have the time to do the quest on one go. So I, I really want to do the quest on one go. You've come. You bastard. I intentionally slowed my integration into the collective consciousness because I wanted to see you one last time as Ilias. What the? And I wanted to apologize to you as him. It was only at Gondarvaville that the second thing I must do occurred to me. Bring you all here. To throw off the Matra and bring Alhatham to the Hive. That was my task. As Siraj number 36. Rose got ear canceling headphones. You honestly think he cares about you? You were already Siraj number 36? But you passed the Matra's <laughs> lie detector test! Yes, clearly, the, the 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 epitome of of reliability. Yes, I truly did forget many things during that time. Even my identity and assigned responsibilities. Ooh. However, it's not that I got scared and forgot. I chose to delete those memories. He pulled a GLaDOS from Plural 2! Whoa! Oh shit, that's creepy. Ooh, that's cool. It's difficult to fool all Hatham, so I had to create the perfect guise for myself. It's like that guy from Bleach that released his memories so that he could infiltrate properly. Oh! It's kind of funny that I've seen this plot multiple times. Wait. But that's it's cool. It's cool every time that it pops up. And the best if I had a nickel you for every time that I rocks. see this, I'd have like three nickels. <laughs> Correct. I only told you that the hive was incomplete because I had deleted my memories of its completion. It was finished a long time ago. Before I left, I was already living as number 36. Now, I choose to return to that identity. Only here can I be truly free. <laughs> That's all I wanted to say. After I enter this room, my consciousness will merge back into the collective. And so, this is goodbye. Is this your uh. decision? 
All right. Huh. Yeah, the person we know is Ilyas, not Siraj number 36. The outside world is painful sometimes, but Paimon doesn't think that's a reason to run away. Do you need more time to consider, Ilyas? Hey, who are... Oh. That is Siraj. Ooh. So you're that Giga Jerk. Giga Jerk? Huh, how bold of you. Have I done something to offend you? What if we just merged the Traveler Paimon into the Collective Consciousness? Yeah. I modified Akasha terminals to allow users to share memories and emotions. Then, then I, recruit. I recruited researchers from the academia to build a collective consciousness. I assigned numbers to everyone and divided the experiment's tasks amongst themselves. Here, people can live easily and happily without needing to exercise complex mental thought. Yes, this, this is what, what they, have, they chosen. have chosen. All I've done is fulfill their wishes. Yeah. You're just trying to justify yourself. Then I ask. She's not you, wrong. What's the difference between here and the outside? That's exactly what a Discord mod says. I shouldn't say that I'm a Discord mod. Never mind. There are researchers like technically, at the academia. I have my own Discord server. Never mind. In dangerous research in extreme Oops, environments. Oops, I'm collateral where damage. Others become idle and listless. People are so obsessed with collective will that even that those even on those... the fringes will attempt to fit in after suffering setbacks. Isn't that right, Elias? Honestly, yeah, the collective, the, the place looks pretty good. <sighs> ah, saying that that's not what a Discord mob would say, ah, means that <laughs> that's exactly what, is exactly what a Discord mob would say. <laughs> There's no need to deny this, as it is fact. It is, it is natural. natural for social, social creatures to congregate together. And the term well, that's so of boring is a collective consciousness through which even an ordinary bee colony Th that's can so become boring, a powerful though. swarm. Replace the bees with humans, and this model becomes even more potent. The problem <laughs> there's so many faults to that. To that like line of thinking. Welcome to the hive, all Hatham. You once arrogantly denied the merits of this project before the Grand Sage. And he will still continue to deny it because it is cringe. A few simple words from you, and my research was consigned to nothingness. Well, yeah. Of course, Duh. I'm well aware that you don't care about any of this. You don't care about the pain of others. Dude, okay, I understand now. I'll hate them so hot. I'm sorry for doubting him. I now understand. But I didn't give up. I made my thesis into reality. And where did that lead you? When we arrived, I noticed many empty rooms in the hive. <laughs> oh, you noticed that? <laughs> then can you guess where their inhabitants are? The answer is the academia. They're executing another phase of the plan. Plan to install me as a sage. Please shut up. Please just stop explaining your evil mastermind plan. The collective consciousness links all of us into a single mind. He's Showcasing still talking. Our individual strengths as we work together. We are able to execute complex undertakings while instantaneously modifying our strategies in response to unexpected situations. Everything has been proceeding smoothly. You are our biggest obstacle. The project will snowball until ultimately everyone will be part of my hive. I... No. The hive will be in control. And it will lead the academia towards a new future. We won't let you do this! He's insane. What can you achieve with mere words? You weren't even able to change Ilyas's mind. What if we just stab him? Return to the hive, number 36. <laughs> Whoa. Yes. Yes, must Wait! Don't go back! Uh, look! There are lots of people out there worried about you. Yes, there are so many people worried about you, like your sister. And you aren't an outcast. Aren't we your friends? Please don't work, please don't work, please don't work, please don't work, please. Friendship, friendship is magic does not work. Please, friendship is magic does not work. 
Please, friendship is magic is not work. That's easy for you to say, given that you're travelers. Will you two continue to stay at the academia? When you leave, tragedy will repeat itself. Return number 36. You know as well as I do that comforting words don't make life any easier. You two are just as arrogant as all hate them. You think that everyone should be like you and live according to their own truths. But you don't realize that most people simply want easy lives. That's true. That's very true. That is very, very, very true. Even if we don't think about it, we want to be happy. I allowed number 36 to leave the hive without his memories only because I knew he would eventually This proves return. that I know. This proves that I know more about human nature than you do. I'll hate them. Do say a word or two. I will consider them as your last. Oh, okay. Let's not light ourselves here. You will get murdered. I made those words quite clear a year ago. The model you presented was extremely unstable. No amount of garish packaging will change its fragile nature. Yes, because the collective consciousness just never works. <sighs> it can't be helped. If you were clever enough to realize those problems, then you would have been aware that the hive changed when Ilios returned to this collective consciousness of yours. What? See, you get one virus from one part of the hive, then everything else gets corrupted. What's happening? A virus. The collective needs motivation to execute its plans, just as machinery requires energy to operate. Not completely the same thing, but okay, hate them, pop off. That's why you, as the Overmind, synchronized your hatred of me into the collective, prompting them to create and execute a plan to eliminate me. Okay, However, not wrong. When Ilias returned to the collective, every, every... his memories and emotions were shared with the rest of its members. This includes his perception of me. See? Why collective consciousness just never works. If the person at the top is an idiot, everything else falls apart. <laughs> Thanks for that. You know, you don't seem like such a bad person. <laughs> These two are so done. These two are just waiting to get paid. Strange, isn't it? Why did I have those thoughts at that time? This contradicts the hatred you had provided them. And these two differing emotions will give rise to new conflict. So that's it. Wait, so you knew that Ilias would return to the hive? And then you pretended to keep him around just to fool Siraj. Wouldn't expect any less from you, all Hatham. Once the collective consciousness bugs out, we'll take that opportunity to... Uh, wait, it's back to normal already. You seem to fail to understand that humans are monkey see, monkey do. It's not really that hard to indoctrinate a person. <laughs> You'd be surprised, Paimon. <laughs> You'd be very, very surprised. All Haytham, I told you. You're too arrogant. Did you really think that your little scheme would be enough to destabilize the hive? I wonder if we ran like an antivirus. Ilias's return had indeed introduced abnormal emotions into the hive, but... Such a meager drop cannot give rise to waves. Ooh. Your struggle has been in vain, and it's time to end it. Allow me to show you what makes the collective consciousness so formidable. So many monsters. Where did they come from? Yeah, where did they come from? And something feels off about them. I also integrated monsters into the Collective, though I ranked them last. Even so, they are part of it. Despite their lack of intelligence, perfect cooperation can be achieved. Now then, drown in endless waves of monsters. Hey, I'll hate them? Uh, you proved that it works, so what do we do now? I've already sent my gift to the Collective. It'll take some time for the recipient to receive it. You two just need to brace yourselves for the nuisance in front of us. Well, all right. Paimon doesn't know how you... 
power of friendship did not work. Therefore, we will have chemicals. Uh, the thought of the collective consciousness is really weird because a lot of people have that idea that if humanity just lost their isn't that bad of a person. But it has to be done. We must be eliminated so that we can evolve. <laughs> wait, 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 I just realized something really stupid. <laughs> hey, Thumb. If we put it into monkey words, but in thoughts. <laughs> I can't believe that simping for Alhatham will save Sumeru. <laughs> oh my god. You see? That is the will of the collective. <laughs> if the will just starts simping for Alhatham, everything will be fine. <laughs> Even with the hatred gone, they continue oh, their work. Oh no. An external anomaly cannot shake the collective stability. Oh my god! No way! Go. They had to put Alhatham somewhere in here, huh? Do you have any fun? This is Alhatham story quest. I had to readjust like the, the stream plan. Squall Fury. I know the hair was pretty good. Upon the game, he won't hold out for much longer. He's a lot tougher than we imagined. Something's gone wrong with the team. The march. Collective symphony. Kick. <laughs> I cannot get over that. Into the wind. Everybody sit. What's going on? What's with this sudden influx of information? <laughs> I'll hate them just put the entire B movie script into the consciousness. <laughs> Silence! Has the overmind, I command you. Oh? <laughs> I wouldn't doubt that. I wouldn't doubt if Haytham just put the entire B movie script here. <laughs> Man. The wind knows. How is that possible? Why hasn't it been resolved yet? Wes Wes. The will of the collective cannot be wrong. The overmind must have made an error in his judgment. Exactly, see? If the person if the overmind is stupid, then everyone else is stupid. He is number one. His judgment is the optimal one. Allegedly. He's just dumb. Oh man. <laughs> oh? Calm down. Don't you have an easy way to figure this out? <laughs> you were only designated as number 36. What a shame. From what I can see, your talents merit a smaller number. Putting aside the validity of the data, it is meaningless to judge individuals based solely on their Nyana energy. What you said to Elias has now become a memory shared by all members of the Hive. I see it now! You've channeled and amplified their selfish desires! You're trying to destroy my hive from the inside out! Human minds are not infinitely pliable, and your hive has stretched many of them to their limit. Once your authority as Overmind starts to wane, it won't be long before your subjects snap back. Is it worth living here like a machine? Being a tool for the rest of my life? As soon as one person begins to have these thoughts, selfishness, doubt, and fear will propagate. Thanks to the web of consciousness <laughs> that you built. At this stage, your so-called hive has already fallen. It's not over yet. You I forgot to take into account mind. that humans are dicks. <laughs> <laughs> It's too late. Once the desires of the hive accumulate, beyond a certain threshold, they will kill their king. He's gonna kill him? I wouldn't have suffered such a disgraceful defeat. 
defeated, I was the only one. My numbers shouldn't be so far down the list. Thrawn's just a liar. This isn't what we agreed to. I should be the one in your position. Whoa, that was. Oh, is he? Oh, he's not. Masculine toxicity, toxic masculinity has prevailed. Members of a collective consciousness are more likely to reach a consensus because of their shared memories and emotions. But unfortunately, for example, Ilios did have differing perceptions, but he ultimately followed the collective consciousness's judgment. However, this system is far from perfect. Based on this logic, the collective consciousness will generate an intractable diffusion effect upon encountering negative emotions. The disturbance that Ilios caused wasn't for naught. It made the collective question the overmind. Setbacks in the plan further amplify doubt, which diminishes the overmind's influence. This inevitably causes the collective to generate negative emotions. Apprehension, disappointment, panic, avarice. These negative emotions can be very well hidden, as humans generally do not share completely transparent channels of communication. My conscious self isn't completely the word. But human nature is very, very uh, individualistic. But in the hive, where there are no secrets, Negativity can spread like a tidal wave. Of course, what I said to Ilios <laughs> was the trigger for all of this. This is why the internet is really bad. Kappa. A few words were enough. <laughs> Believe in the power of words, Siraj. Believe in the L plus bozo. You were already thinking of a way to destroy the collective consciousness. Even back then. You knew that Ilios was the bait all along. Probably not, because I have to eat. Know? And do my homework. Since when? I knew it from the moment I saw him. Oh. Moreover, I never looked down on you. My opinion of you has Hello, always been objective. You have a naive view towards the concepts of collective consciousness and human evolution, but you are intelligent and disciplined. You would never let a test subject escape. <sighs> Mistakes like that are beneath you, and you also won't leave any mistake without a resolution. <laughs> I never thought I'd hear those words come from you. Not 5 p.m. right now. But if you're saying that out it of is. sympathy, spare me. No. I know very well that you've never viewed me as an equal. When you were with us, you always had a distant look in Whoopsie. You don't need to hide it. I know it better than anyone else. The arrogance that comes with being a genius. Nobody likes being treated like that. Your perspective is entirely born from your habitual way of looking at things. From your perspective, you probably think I'm like you. Someone who doesn't fit in. However, I've never placed myself on a pedestal. That's exactly what someone that would place themselves on a pedestal would say. Uh, I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I just want to distance myself from meaningless noise and look at everything objectively. We'll get to that later. On the other hand, you have failed to come to terms with who you truly are. You care too much about winning and how others perceive you. You mean to say that I'm the arrogant one here? Is that not so? Arrogant and emotionally fragile. <laughs> you people as a simple mediocre collective, while you regard me as one of your kind. <laughs> Regardless, I have lost. You can take me back to the academia and stand trial. 
You will stand trial, yes. But arresting people isn't in my job description. I'm just an ordinary staff member. I believe it is the General Mahamatra's duty to escort you away. Uh, oh! Sinok! <laughs> Sinok! <laughs> I followed the symbols. Looks like things have already been set. Oh my gosh, the lighting is making him look so bright. As a fellow, <laughs> fellow brown skinned person, I completely understand this lighting. <laughs> Damn. Oh, whoops. Goodbye. Symbols. I left a similar picture in my letter to him, and I made several similar symbols on the way here. Wait, what do you mean you left a letter? Oh, the doggy has letter. cometh. When Paimon first saw you, Arab said that you had left a letter for Sino. So you really did know that something was up with Ilyas from the start! Uh, you lied to us too! It'd be best if you didn't spout nonsense. I never employed any mode of trickery on you. By the way, I came across some information at the Academia a few days ago. If you practice the method discussed therein, your vision, vision will improve. improve. Do you need it? Seriously? <laughs> Sarai sent more people to the Academia, but can't let those jerks get away! Don't worry. The Matra have started screening suspicious persons, and we've already arrested many of Sarai's associates. This was likely one factor that caused the Hive's consciousness to waver. Everything went as you predicted, All Haytham. Good. <laughs> Seems like the interesting part is already over. I'll leave the arrests to you all. See you. And off he goes. <sighs> there still are a lot of test subjects here, so let's stick around for a while. <sighs> let's talk to Sainu. Let's not talk. Okay. Oh no. Oh no. I was involved in all these plans to get rid of the acting Grand Sage? What came over me? How could I do something like this? We were accomplices without knowing it. But I'm afraid that Alhatham might pressure the Matra into giving us heavier sentences. Whether he's the scribe or the acting Grand Sage, we can't afford to offend him. Yeah. It seems our future at the Academia will be full of uncertainties. Dude, the fucks he gives about other people are so small to the point that he'd probably never even remember that you were part of the collective consciousness in the first place. You overestimate how many fucks I'll hate them gives about you. We can discuss the future later. Leaving the collective left me with a strange sense of guilt. I didn't feel anything towards I'll hate them at first, since he wasn't well known. Whoa. <laughs> All the opinions I heard about him were negative, though. That's true. That's true. <laughs> Siraj made us hate all Haytham, and we blindly accepted that hatred and thought of him as a bad person. From how things look, we've done a lot of irrational things. Hmm. I guess we're getting what we deserve. Uh, could you help us apologize to all Haytham? Sure. Paimon will help you tell all Haytham, but whether he chooses to forgive you is up to him. True. It's okay. No matter what he chooses. Apologizing, Apologizing will make us feel less. If, if he chooses, chooses to remember to this, we're prepared, we're prepared for, for punishment. punishment. It's time to go. <sighs> Let's go. Alhatham doesn't care enough about these people to actually give them a sentence as a thing. So, were they all duped? We can ask Alhatham about that later. Oh, hello. You're still alive. Looks like I can't exist as Siraj number 36. Yet, my life as Ilyas goes on. When I was at Gandharvaville, I thought about whether I should just come forward with the truth. But I didn't have the courage then. Whoopsie! So in the end, I lost my sense of justice. But I also wasn't able to conform. Ilyas? Don't 
be sad. I'm the one who deceived you. However, I didn't come out of this completely empty-handed. The moment the hive collapsed, an idea popped into my head. I realized that the collective I was always trying to fit into wasn't as powerful as I had imagined. Understanding that gave me courage somehow. Perhaps one day I could be just like all Hatham and not care about what anyone else thinks. You can do it. Paimon believes in you. <laughs> Thanks. Well, I should get going. I'm one of the primary suspects in the case, so I'll have to receive my due punishment. Can you <sighs> keep this a secret from my parents and my sister? I just don't want them to worry. Also, please apologize to all Haven for me. Goodbye, you two. Goodbye. All the test subjects have been taken away. Thank you, doggy. <laughs> uh, my seal the place, retrieve all documentation, and destroy the system. Are you two hurt? I brought bandages and hemostatics. Oh, he's so sweet. Thank you. Fine. <sighs> Just a little tired. Get some rest. Oh, Hatham is probably waiting for you at the entrance. Go see him when you're done here. Bye bye. Watch out for any of Siraj's associates who might still be in hiding. If you encounter anything you can't take care of, come find me at the academia. Okay, you stay safe too, Sino. Let's go meet up with Al Haytham. Ooh. Ooh. Did Coffee Banner already drop? Did it? Did it? Did it? Wait, 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 I need to know. It ain't here, buddy. It's not here yet. It's not. Oh, here it is. Oh my god, I just had to refresh. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Cave. 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 Shit! But, but I want the cave! Oh, who is she? <laughs> Can we at least have a cave in here? Cave, cave. Oh, who is she? I'm missing a Haunting face. Is she a lost empress? <laughs> okay, guys. Um. Ah! Eternally. Oh, who is she? Cave, 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 cave. Yes, yes. C two, C one, C one in here. Come on, don't be shy. Don't be shy, buddy. Give me the guy. Give me the college graduate. Yes. Okay. I want C1, I want C1, I want C1, I want C1, I want C1. I'm gonna be greedy. And I don't get C1. Okay, okay, I got it, I got it, I got it. I'm sorry, I'm a clown. Hong Kong actually called me a Fatui Harbinger. Jesus. All right, well, let's just do one last, because like that's... Are you the first person to actually get by you? <laughs> I... Oh, come on. Whatever, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Am I the first person to get Baishu in the entirety of Genshin Impact? <laughs> Listen. I don't think 
that's completely wrong. You, you that banner was like up for like a minute. <laughs> that banner was up for like a minute. World record, two minutes in. Baiju. <laughs> Jesus, at least it's on stream, guys. Let it be known that it took Aster one minute to fuck up her entire pity <laughs> of 10. Oh, yeah, it's okay. World record. Guys, this is why you should stream. Okay, I'm sorry for the volume and the panic and the words. World record as their dick. <laughs> it wasn't even like um <laughs> the matter is set. <laughs> return now. How unfortunate. <laughs> was, was that your luckiest sooner. pull in general? No. You wanna know what my luckiest pull was? My luckiest pull in the entirety of Genshin Impact was I got C1 D Luke on the beginner banner. And I was so confused because I genuinely thought that it was a bug and that the look was not rare because I got two of him. My boyfriend was watching the stream at the time and was like, what the fuck? <laughs> so I started the game at AR10 with a C1 D look and official. So no. <laughs> Judging by your faces, it seems like you <laughs> Oh my gosh. I, mean, I don't even want Baiju. <laughs> what do I do with Baiju? <laughs> but I'm off the clock now, so I'm not going to field any questions. Nice. I need to look at some fun with you. You look hard. We're not your colleagues, we're uh, your friends. You couldn't tell that was an excuse just now? What? Are you kidding me? I will flex my C1D look, beginner's look, with a passion. Can you explain what happened back at Siraj's secret base? Do you have Skyno or do you, did you skip him? I have Skyno. See ya. Bye, bitch. Uh, hold it right there. She's going to like throw a celestial nail done? at you. Your behavior is reminding me of some other people. Stop changing the subject. You don't want to incur Paimon's wrath. What if she becomes like the one of the three shades or the primordial one? Honestly, knowing hates him, she's gonna be like, cool story, bro. L plus ratio. <laughs> It's too much of a hassle to explain everything from the top. You know what? Come with me. Uh, where to? You'll know when we get there. Dude, his abs. Thanks, Hoyo. They learn from their mistakes. Every time that I say that Genshin improved, I'm meaning that they finally gave the characters abs. <laughs> the nerd did not deserve to have those abs. Dean, I'm coming for you. Pop off, Dean. Ooh. There are no accidents. If any, well, that was that was off. That was that was weird. Uh, well. <laughs> Hello. Hope you guys didn't miss the the the, the pool. I guess. What's this? Oh, it's Amos bow. Oh, no, no. No, no, no. What does this give us? This gives HP. What? Yep, yeah, yep, I've done Hedas part two. <laughs> look at this, look at the staff. Look at the staff incident. Ooh, spicy. <laughs> the stick incident. Better than prototype Amber. Thing is, like, I can't really get this even if I wanted to, so I'm not gonna bother. Quick dun, 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 dun. Oh, who is she? I'll hate them home. Oh, wow! Take me out to dinner first! Kappa! That's uh, that, that's uncomfortable because Paimon's with us. Don't joke about that, Aster! <laughs> Is this your home? 
Wait, it's so pretty. Oh my yes. god. What's with you all of a sudden? Being all polite and inviting us over? Oh my god. Hello. Ah, you're back. <laughs> question mark, question mark, question mark. Things all straightened. Uh, and huh? Who are they? <laughs> Excuse me. Who are you? Could you please leave my house? <laughs> I think of course moved by you as well. Stop making a fuss. They're obviously guests. You dare put shoes in my house? <laughs> You're not from the academia, are you? No, we're not. I'm unsure she's seen you before. <gasps> you never heard me from Mankind in that one place! Yes. Yes, Paimon. Yes. Wait, what? How do you know me? Oh no, oh no, do people know that I live here? <laughs> is he... Is he scared that people will know he has a house? I... I... <laughs> what? You're embarrassed only now of all times? Oh, you guys are roommates! More like housemates. This is this yes, isn't really qualify as a room. Keep that to yourselves, please. Don't tell anyone else. I keep a few books on collectives and the subconscious here at home. Is this I'll the first it. time you meet him? You no, it's not supposed to be. We met. We meet him in the. Oh, we we see him in the in the Arkan quest, talking to Alhitham. But this is the first time we've actually genuinely met him. You're leaving just like that? What's the deal, I'll hate them? Uh... <laughs> uh... Sorry, I know we've only just met, but I have to ask. Are you, um... <laughs> you wouldn't have to be actors that I'll hate them hired to pretend to be his friends, would you? No, no, no! Perfectly fair. Guess not. I've never seen him invite friends home before, so please excuse my surprise. Right. You guys get it, right? You know, with his temperament and stuff. <laughs> but aren't you friends with him? Ew, no! Uh, I wouldn't say friends, exactly. Okay. Well, we used to be, but we're not anymore. Oh, I, you just happen to live with him? Truly. Yeah, there's a lot of dialogue in mind reading after the quest ends. The girls are fighting here, Aster. Yeah, I, my headset lost its battery, so you guys are going to hear the video. Huh? Don't worry about it. My name is Kave. I'm sorry to have met you under these circumstances. <laughs> anyway... Please don't say anything about me living here. There's something creepy about this angle. <laughs> it's like... Hello, and welcome to the simulation. We would like to override your memories and replace some new ones. Are you prepared for this examination? <laughs> oh my god, I've never realized how creepy that looks. You seem like you got a lot going on. So maybe some more will make Paimon shut up. Jesus. Are you serious? How could you? Oh, of course. <laughs> Minus well, 100 friendship friends. score. Please don't mind him. That was a normal response. You exposed your own weakness. <laughs> Still, why do you have to treat me like he does? Judging by the deafening din coming from the living room, you all must be getting along quite well. Hmm. Entertain your own friends, why don't you? No! No! We started with bad social scar! I'll leave the books here. <laughs> Trigger warning! My homework! <laughs> oh shit, I just remembered I have homework. I'm dizzy from reading. Oh, don't you know. too complicated. Why don't we just ask questions instead? Oh boy. Boy. Consciousness's weakness. You know how I always thought that? Why would you have trigger warnings for the most mundane of things? Yeah, I understand now. A year ago, Siraj presented his thesis to the Grand Sage, who offhandedly asked for my opinion. 
I actually responded with two lines of reasoning. The first, as I've already said, was that his research was on human evolution, a subject prohibited by the academia. Well, yeah. The second was that I thought the direction of his research was too extreme, but his approach too conservative. That's, that's pretty true. One way to stabilize a collective consciousness is to remove the test subject's humanity altogether. The optimal solution to achieve collective consciousness is to focus solely on the overmind and treat the other test subjects as tools. That's way too dangerous. You're not seriously considering that, are you? Because, uh... Whew. I'm merely stating the facts. If Siraj had done that... I would have felt his work to be just as senseless. It's impossible for any species to evolve overnight, and humans without their humanity cannot be called humans. Yeah, they become monkeys. Monkey. <laughs> Monkey. That's why the academia prohibited research into human evolution. Most research of this kind tends to run contrary to evolution. Monkey. Huh. I'm on kids it now. Ha. <laughs> That's rich coming from you. If humans aren't humans without their humanity, then you'll probably evolve into some other species in another decade, I wager. <laughs> what about you? Are you going to devolve into a fungus? Monkey! At least I'd be a fungus with empathy. <laughs> oh no! He lost the... <laughs> he... <laughs> He's book smart, but bruh. <laughs> Sorry for eavesdropping, but what happened to you guys? Are you in trouble? I like how he's always under the assumption that we're being held hostage here. Sort of. We encountered a strange researcher that had it out for us. Are you all okay? To be precise, they had it out for us. Hate them. We just happened to be there. We were collateral damage. Huh. So that's how things went. Such is life. <laughs> if only he'd known, Al Haytham could have stayed indoors today, and the whole thing could have been avoided, right? Plus, he could have helped me with the housework for once. See those books? They've been sitting there waiting for someone to sort through them for an age. If you're not gonna read them, tidy them away. They don't belong there. Okay, Mom. <laughs> SMH. Oh, he's a big man child. Can you feel the awkwardness in the air? I hope you're aware of your lack of conversational skills. <laughs> oh, so the pot's calling the kettle black, is he? <laughs> well, <laughs> having said all that, are you okay? Oh, how is this gonna end? This is gonna end really poorly. I'm doing quite well. Much better than that painting you're trying to hang on the wall. Man, Severo characters just have the best fucking lines. I swear. I everyone everyone tells me that Inazuma characters have the best lines. Leo a character with the best lines. No 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 no. Sumeru characters and their dialogues are on a whole nother level of feeling like actual human beings. We'll say them. <laughs> but oh snap! Nation of wisdom. Mmm. Nation of wisdom got them. Linguistics up just for the maximum burn. You... You don't understand anything. Stop criticizing my taste in decoration. Mom, they're fighting. <laughs> Mother, they're fighting. Discomfort. Paimon can't tell which of them is more problematic. <sighs> Let's just get this over with and leave. I blame your curiosity, Paimon. Let's just get this over with. Please, I don't want to be here no more. You whisper very loudly. She wasn't even whispering. Oh, um, yeah, Paimon's been told that. Do you have any more questions? Let Paimon think. Uh, oh, by the way, the other researchers apologize to you. They hope that you can forgive them. Wait, let me load my roll 20 before I continue with this. 
I bear them no ill will. More accurately, I don't really care about what they think of me. To some extent, they were also fooled by Siraj. The Matra will take this into account at their trials. Ilyas also said that he wanted to tell us the truth at Gondarvaville, but he didn't have the courage. Uh -huh. He apologized to you too. It doesn't matter. I never considered asking him to come forward with the truth. Judging from his experiences, he's more courageous than the average person. There's no need to lay even more criticism on him. That or more stupid, pick one. only shows how weak you yourself are. <laughs> oh, pop off, hate them. Pop off. Never change, I'll hate them. I'm going for dinner in ten minutes, so I'll field one last question. Paimon doesn't have any more questions. How about you? What were you actually interested in, Hatham? I'll hate them. Oh, yeah, that's a good question. You only started investigating with the Matra at the Academia because you were interested in something, right? But after meeting Siraj, it didn't seem like you were interested in him or his experiment. I had no interest in him personally, but... I was curious as to why so many people were willing to form a collective consciousness with him. Oh. So it wasn't really... Okay, so it wasn't really the project, it was more so like the intentions of the people, which is very fascinating. I now understand the reason. Something to do with the current atmosphere of the academia, I suppose? No. I like to think that Hatham's just gonna say, no, they're idiots. <laughs> Correct. Now. The fall of the sages and the shutdown of the Akasha terminals deeply affected the academia. That's true. The fact that Siraj's project attracted so much interest despite not being approved speaks to the lack of research projects as of late. As the acting Grand Sage, I'll have to figure something out. In addition, what happened to Ilyas is worth our attention. Reporting academic fraud was the right thing to do. He didn't deserve the outcome that he had received. Yeah, he didn't. Paimon understands now. Oh, you're pretty serious when it comes to work, huh? He is, isn't he? I think minimum viable seriousness is a more apt description. I'll do my best to take care of this mess until my resignation is approved. We'll see you in ten years. Wait, your resignation? Well, yeah, he's trying to get the hell away from this position. Yes. I've already submitted my resignation to the Academia. Soon, I'll resign as the Acting Grand Sage and go back to be- I don't think Siraj knew about that. If he had waited just a few more days before acting, I would have already resigned. What he'd do then wouldn't have been any concern of mine. However, <laughs> even without my input, his unstable model would have collapsed for some other reason, so it makes no difference. That's true. Humans are monkeys. Why do you want to resign? Why wouldn't you want to resign? I'm not suited to be a sage, nor do I want to be one. The official process to select the new sages is already underway, but this process is long and takes far too much time. If I serve as acting Grand Sage for too long, the position might become permanent. That <laughs> would be troublesome. He's trying to get this out as fast as he can. I want to spend the rest of my life doing. You have a pretty strong. <laughs> Why? Yes. I forgot to tell them I was streaming. Anyway. It's important to keep your priorities <laughs> straight. Well, it's about time. You two what is he doing? Grab some dinner as well. Yes, we should grab some dinner. Oh, now that you say that, Paimon's kind of hungry. Basket? See yeah, there was a basket of mojos. Yummies. Goodbye. See ya. See ya. No, no, don't let me go. Don't let me out just yet. I wish. No! The name Siraj doesn't ring a bell. Was he in your class? He isn't someone who would leave an impression, so it's expected that you don't remember him. Ah! I've always had a hard time appreciating the way that the academia pressures people by labeling them as geniuses. I guess I'll just have to Google what they're saying. But even so, the Academia can't be left to you. <laughs> True. Or perhaps I should say that I'm delighted to see that you have a base amount of self-awareness. 
If the people in the Academia haven't gone mad, they'd know that I'm much more suited to be a sage than you. Is he jealous? And I suppose they'd let everyone know that your career as a sage will be as shaky as that painting. Again, that's mighty rich coming from someone about to resign. In a few days, you'll be managing files again. You'll be back at rock bottom. Tia, what's up with these two? But my salary will likely stay the same. <laughs> Wait, what? How come? Why do you get special treatment? I mean, the thing is, though, he doesn't get special treatment. This f f fella. Sir. My friend. You good, buddy? Dude, he is pissed. Dude, he is pissed. Oh. Ooh, he is pissed. At least I don't have to be an architectural designer who works himself to death just to get a smile from his client. Is he not getting paid? Is... Is he not getting paid? Y you... You... I took time out of my day to clean the living room for you, and this is the thanks I get for it? I'd have been better off catching up on my work. I still have designs to finish. Make sure to pay back the rent you owe me. I'm going to buy some furniture with that, Mora. <sighs> Yo! What? Are you trying to annoy me to death? The Oopsie. decorations you buy keep getting uglier and uglier. What's the point of having a boring wood carving in your house? He's not wrong. <laughs> You'll have to blame that on my financial freedom. <laughs> Fine. Go ahead and hide behind your financial success if you want. But if we forget Mora for a second, do you have anything of true value to boast about? Ooh, he's getting cocky. I think I'd have too many choices, to be honest. You, on the other hand, can you think of any redeeming features at all? Oh. Artistry, for sure. You don't know the first thing about interior design. Don't go off buying random furniture unless you take me with you. They're, they're arguing like a... So I'll have to bring you along and then buy you drinks? Of course. What is this? Kave is popping off. Like, pop off, Kave. <laughs> My guy's like negotiating his like life savings here. But why would I do that? It would just be another form of a loan. And you'd have to pay me back eventually. Can't you just be nice and not ask for the Mora back? That's rich coming from the person that's asking for the drinks. Pretending that you're not in debt is as ridiculous as pretending you're not living in someone else's home. That's not wrong. The word will get out sooner or later. They're still fighting. Speaking of which, your friends won't say anything, right? Tell them to keep all this a secret. There's no need to hide it so carefully. I think the truth's already out. You're such a lightweight that a few <laughs> times at the tavern had you spilling all your beans. No way! What? No, it can't be. Help! What an idiot! Okay, okay. Oh, they're gone. Wait, they're not. Okay, 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 okay. Don't move, don't move, don't move! Yes. Don't move, don't move, don't move. Don't move, don't move, don't move, don't move. I've been waiting for you for ages. It's my Genshin broke. Everyone hold hands. I see everything. There's dust on the bookshelves. I should tidy <laughs> them up sometime and bring any unused books to the house of Dana. Where's she going? Whoa! Where's my in the heater going? Oh, Hatham isn't thinking about revealing my secret, is he? Jeez, why does he always have these horrible thoughts? Does he really want to mess with me that much? And what he said just now... D does he know about my drunken scribbling? That's yeah, Nahida. Are you streaming? No. Yes, I'm streaming. Wait, did someone tell me? <laughs> Was it the people at the tavern? Or the liquor shop? Why, that owner? 
He promised to keep this a secret. Also, is it really true that I can't hold my liquor? Going through a whole monologue. But impulsive speaking and writing were normal after a few drinks. Oh well, everyone loves to write random stuff on the message boards anyway, so. Dude, he went through like a whole escapade there, just trying to rationalize his thoughts. I hope this guy is okay. Okay, but let's stay here for a bit in his house. Do I want to get to see one? Wait, I actually want to see. I can't believe we got to see paywalled Lord. I can't believe Lord is getting paywalled. Uh, where is he? Where is he? Have. What does he scale off of? Is he just like regular damage? Looks at it. Mental gymnastics at its finest, truly. Oh, he's a healer! What? Wait. Is he? Or is he like a... Is he like a gene? Listen, I just pulled him because he's pretty. What the? Uh-oh... He only heals... Okay. Okay. Got it. Got it. Hmm. He's a life stealer. Uh, uh, where's my key? Uh, oh, not again. I want his lore. Give me the lore. Do I get the lore? No! <laughs> ah, I want to make a video on Kave! All right, he gets the pretty, the pretty weapons. Dendro cards heal him instead of damaging him. No, we're going to have to grind for him. That's not good. Wait, I kind of want this one. If a bloom rations can be triggers, we can have some pain great painted dome. They won't. What a random number! Sixty-one point eight percent. Wait, you don't have the flower claymore? What flower claymore? Oh, I haven't played it. The Boys in the Tavern talks about both of them, you don't they? It's not just- it doesn't just talk about both of them. They are both of them. <laughs> Alright. Mailed flower from the monster. Fourth row, first one. What? I'm so confused. What flower? Ah, this one! This one, got it. I was like, what the? Gotcha. Alright. Um. <coughs> what about the small in his lore details and his skill and verse? It won't be enough. I have to actually wait. That's kind of sad. Alright. I don't think I can get anything here anymore, so... What am I? I'm at... That took a while. It did. It took three hours. But there were a lot of interventions and... Uh, I guess I'm just going to upload a new icon. Something on your mind again? Let's work through it together. Do I'm gonna to upload a new want? thumbnail and I'll, I'll do the quest next time for the next chapter, but... That's nice. That's really nice. This story quest really hits home for me because um, I'm a student. <laughs> Anything that's academia related in Genshin right now, it's just just hits so hard. Especially like since it's it's been a really difficult uh, time juggling all of this, juggling YouTube and um, streaming now, and like I really do wanna add more stuff uh, to this channel but it, it, it has been a lot so this this arc could, this, this story quest kind of whew, kind of scared me honestly uh, as a as a, uh, a researcher there's a lot of problems that this posed that really hit hard and one of them was a person's already uh, on the brink of suicide, and the first thing that the people say- Well, not brink, actually executing it. The, per the people around them say that, um... 
you're being a, a heavyweight. Or at least in our language, that's pabigat. Um, it's kind of sad, but it happens so many times. The first thing that people say when someone's sick or dying or just like not feeling well is you're not uh, cooperating or at least you're not pulling your weight. And that's the first reaction. That's always the implication around. It's kind of sad, really. But what do you call this? Sometimes, like it, it's for not. Like for example, if a person is going through something um, very personal, that's fair game. And it, it's really sad. I don't know. That's why it was really, really difficult for me to go through that. Um, through those. Um, it was really difficult for me to go through all of that. As a student, would you change the IRL school system if it was in your power? The thing is, the grading system is what I will choose. I, I will, I will, I will change. I will say to this right now: the grading system is not good. It is not good whatsoever. The grading system is very flawed, and the grading system is what needs to be changed. Learning in and of itself is such a beautiful thing. Like, I would never want school to actually be abolished because how else will we learn about the random stuff in life that makes, you know, it pretty fun. But there is just so much stress and nuance in being a... a what do you call that? Especially since like, it was like about a, a topic about research too. Eesh, that hit a little too close to home. So sorry if I was like super quiet. Um... I'm sorry if I, it was like, uh, what do you call that? I was super quiet during that moment, or it was like super loud, but... I, either one of those two. But they really... They hit close to home. In a way that I did not want this game to hold close to home to. Ah, that was very uncomfortable. Ooh, yeesh. Yeah. Because... The thing is, um... What I like about this story quest is that... It doesn't have a happy ending. Like, the happy ending isn't that happy either. The problem was resolved, but if you really, really look at the the problem, like the thing about the collective consciousness, it's that human desire is inevitably flawed to the point that human a collective consciousness would never work because it's so easy to invoke the the, the worst in the human subconsciousness. People act a certain way. Communication accommodation theory is um, a very popular theory that says that humans accommodate based on their social environment. And that's why we don't say, you know, bad word. In, you know, we don't say bad words in uh, in a place that's not, that's not called, uh, so socially appropriate. But that doesn't stop the consciousness. You know how, for example, if you don't like a coworker, the socially acceptable thing to do is to not talk shit about them, especially not to their face, and especially not in work. Because one, you're gonna boggle down the morale of the entire part of the entire group, and two, it is that it's just rude. But that doesn't stop the negative thoughts that pop up the first time, like the instinct first, the instinctive negative thoughts um, that pop up in a person. And the second one is when you actually culminate, uh, cultivate that with um, reinforcements. It's a very bittersweet thing. I really like this story quest because it's it's a very, very rare time. It's very, very rare for Genshin to actually not have a completely happy ending. Yes, Haytham got like the... Al Haytham got like the last laugh. But the social commentary of this quest is so much more different than the other quests. Just because it doesn't have the completely happy of an ending. Kaytham used a really negative aspect of humanity to beat the consciousness. This is very great. This is, this is, I love this story quest so much. It's now one of my newer favorites. The social commentary was on point. The attitudes were on point. Um, I'll hate them not getting a spotlight isn't completely that wrong. Like, I, I don't mind it. It's just in his personality to not be that loud. And Haytham was a very good accessory. I like it. I like it. It is a... Um, it's a very scary... Um, what do you call that? It's a very scary topic. 
it's a human collective consciousness all that great um and it's it doesn't get resolved by just oh oh you know what i was afraid of you know what i was afraid of for this entire thing i was so afraid that how this was going to end was oh humans need their individual willpower or oh human freedom is so important or that's what makes humans humans that's what i was so afraid um that, that's what i was so afraid was going to happen for this story quest that it was going to have such an emphasis on human free will triumphs everything and stuff like that but i'm really happy that it 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 solved it, it incorporated that of course human free will and the, uh, the individual consciousness but it incorporated it in a way that was negative like the negative aspect of humanity was what corrupted the potential of humanity in the first place to create to 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 work as a unit because okay on the paper a collective consciousness minus the individualistic freedom uh, the removal of individualistic freedom is actually not that bad if you looked at how the collective consciousness was actually being operated it was it's basically like a company right um yes there was a bit more indoctrination but if you look at the logistics of it it is humans having a universe uh, like a set motivation all of them had a set motivation which was hating i'll hate hating i'll hate them right and then if you're not sure what um to do next they oh, all had their part to play walk. in the grand scheme of things. And they all and they all surprisingly still had an individual voice. Um, you saw that part in the end where they were all talking. Um technically they're all still like they're part of the collective consciousness, but this doesn't mean that they're completely assimilated as people. Theoretically, it is not bad. That's what humanity can strive to be. That's a concept of a that's a basic concept of um that's the basic concept of a community. The thing about it is that if you just erase the individualistic perspective, that's when it starts becoming, you know, good, dun, 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 dun. <laughs> that's when it becomes a communist state. <laughs> but no, um, it's kind of sad that um, camaraderie, uh, the, the aspect of camaraderie um, is, you know, destructive by human greed, which is... It's great. It's great. Genshin doesn't usually have these core themes. And I like it. I'm really happy that Genshin... Um, Genshin talked about it in this way. The execution of the story quest for me, while it is super wordy, is pretty good. I like it. I like it. I like the message. And I, I like the message even if it wasn't a completely positive message. A lot of Genshin stories are like, friendship will prevail, or we are better than the authorities, or the authorities don't know us better, or human rights, something, something like that. But this story, man, this story hits close. This hits, this is, this is probably one of the most realistic stories in all of Genshin. Which is very weird because it's talking about like, you know, the, the hybrid, the, the mind, the, the collective mind. But yeah, so. I'm actually going to maybe get some rest because I realized that I've been streaming for three hours, um, just like talking, and I hope that you guys enjoyed. I know that I was, I know that a lot of people <laughs> see my streams as like very different from how I usually act on stream. Well, I just hope that you know that those things are scripted, but streams are where my more candid thoughts come out and my more, you know, my personality, I guess. But I also like talking um, on stream because, you know, there's a lot more opinions to be given i really appreciate um i really appreciate um you guys sticking around and for those that were um and to those that are lurking or just chatting just know that i'm very glad that you guys are here this channel will be going through a bit of changes in my opinion a lot of changes actually not a bit because i want to incorporate more topics into well i want to do more topics and the thing is that I'm slowly trying to get myself back hyped back into Genshin, and I thought stream and I think streaming would be a very good way for me to kind of mentally incentivize myself to, to you know, also do this. And I have been completely transparent with all of you as of everything. I am currently actually working towards getting a new PC, and PCs are expensive. Therefore, we will be working hard. I will be working hard to give you guys more videos so that I can pay for the new PC. Okay. That's just how the cookie crumbles. We live in a capitalistic society. You're going to see more of me because I need to pay for that new PC. 
PC parts, let's go. Dude, PC parts are so expensive. So you guys are going to see more of me. So, I'm also planning to do a bit more, like, so I, I, I've seen my analytics, I've done my tests, and I've learned from my mistakes. I'm going to to separate my pop culture video essays and my DND into other channels. Um, I used to I, I used to experiment on a bit of other channels in the past because, um, what do you call that? I was also seeing if it was better, and now that I've gotten my evidence, I was like, yeah, work hard like a horse. Yeah, do these kinds of quests help with motivation to a certain extent? Yeah. Quests like um, I've always had a big problem with Genshin's writing as a lore content creator. My problem with Genshin is that its stories are very, they're very sanitized. Um, then I realized that maybe I just need to 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 think about it from a different perspective. Um, my problem with a lot of character analyses, for example, is that I can't really do a lot of character uh, analyses because the characters on this are, aren't that deep. A lot of them are well, they're they're. They're, they're catered to serve as a product, and they're here to make you feel good. There's only a handful of other characters that don't triumph over any tribulations, that are not secretly rich, or they're not secretly successful, or they're not actually pretty cool, or they can, they can triumph over everything, you never see them cry, you never see them mad, you never see them something like that, you know what I mean? So that really bogged my motivation for talking about Genshin for a very long time, but then I realized that I don't really need to do that if I just like slow myself into what kind of direction I want to make my videos on and I mean that's why I'm making South Park videos surprisingly surprisingly South Park videos are what are currently helping me appreciate Genshin more because um, it's giving me an outlet of my frustrations with Genshin in another media because I love it's character flaws together. I love characters Two that don't win I love characters that lie or cheat um, because they're very fascinating to do a character study on. So, um, what do you call this? Um, there's not a lot of characters in Genshin so that, that can do that. So I'm channeling that want to do character studies, very in-depth character studies into another medium. And leaving my love for the world building of Genshin here. It helped me appreciate what Genshin has. And at the same time, it allowed me to basically explore more uh more of a theme imperfections make characters interesting unfortunately that's not that's just not what i'm seeing from genshin impact i have been looking high and low for kazuha's imperfection and unfortunately i have come to the conclusion that it is not there and any the, the, the my problem with genshin is that it's the, the imperfections are not called imperfections they're just like character quirks the writing doesn't really think of them as imperfections um, most characters just have like funny quirks, like Bennett's bad luck, but in the end he's going to... In the end he's an anime protagonist, something something like that. That's why, um, what do you call this? Talking about South Park really helped me um, appreciate, and you know what, I, I, I appreciate I'll hate him as a character. I actually didn't roll for him because I didn't like his playstyle, and I still kind of don't, so even if he does come back I don't think I'll roll for him, but... It really helped me appreciate him as a character more. Um, a character that doesn't really care. Like, he's not the best, he's not the worst. A lot of characters don't like him, and, you know, it's fine. I, I like it. He has an attitude. This is a very pleasing, this is a very um, nice. Kavi is too much caring of a person. That's fine. I feel like he's compensating for something, Kappa. Oh, yeah. But yeah, that's it for me today. I hope that you guys enjoy. And if you like my content, feel free to subscribe. Uh, feel free to support me on Patreon or, uh, or Coffee. But you'll probably be seeing more of me. I see that this portion has been part... Yeah. Sumer characters have definitely correct... Uh, have made so much improvements to this. Not all characters, of course, but... If you noticed how, um, if you notice how get um, how Sumeri characters are written compared to someone like Inazuma or Liyue, they feel like actual people. <laughs> I'm sorry, this isn't a diss to like the Inazuma characters, of course, but the Sumeri characters just feel, I don't know. They 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 feel nice. They feel 
They feel like they aren't about to go on a 20 page discussion <laughs> about something menial. I don't know, sorry. I really. The, the Sumeria characters just have a massive place in my heart. And so do the Monsa characters. Monsa characters and Inazuma uh, and Sumeria characters. But I hope that you guys enjoyed this, uh, this little stream. This was a surprise stream. And. Um, I'll announce if I'm going to do the the rest of the other streams later, but they feel more human. Yeah, I guess so. They feel they feel less like they feel less like perfect perfection. They feel less. I don't know. Maybe it's the vibe. Maybe it's the execution. The issue is in Azuma writing are well documented at this point. Yes, and I'm very happy that Hoyo has changed them out. I really hope that they they stay consistent with um, the changes. So, yeah. Hope you guys enjoy uh, this stream. I'll be seeing you, and I'm seeing you. Pro ex probably expect a Baiju and a Kave video soon with a dash of Hu Tao. There's something very fascinating about Baiju's um, mentality of um, tampering with immortality for the sake of helping others, versus you know. Not tampering with immortality in the first place. That's something that I really want to talk about. And I'm I'm so excited when Baiju's full character story um, is finally accessible to the public. So I'll see you guys when I see you guys. Bye-bye. See you all when I see you all.